in order. Hello, hi. Uh, just, uh, I've got a guest star here, Teacup, but usually he's pretty chill, but today he seems a little more... Have you found a place to sit? Nope. You're still wandering around? That makes me worry that you're gonna find something to get into- Okay. <laughs> he has now rolled over and showed me his belly. Hi, teacups. Hi, buddy. How's it going? Ah, Lou! Hi, Lou! <laughs> it's just Lou! You're awake this early? Good for you! <laughs> Congrats on getting the first Lou! Hi! How are you? <laughs> I, I, I've been testing out this, uh, these things. Hi, Diggy! How are you? Oh, there's a first snail. Yep! But there- oh, goodness, Teacup! Are you okay? I put that sweater there for a reason, because I knew you- I know you want to sink your claws into my chair. The one thing you haven't sunk your claws into. Well, as best I try. Diggy's here for the pajama party! <laughs> Teacup, you gotta behave, buddy. You gotta behave. I'm a kitty 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 kitty. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, let me catch up to chat. Uh, there's a first now. Yep, yep. And Lou has claimed the first ever first. <laughs> it's 10 p.m. so it's totes fine. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's not early at all. That is a reasonable time to be awake, actually. Hello, world. The first is a first. The first ever that ever was the first. But yeah, now that's a thing, is a little hello prompt. I'm still I'm still in the process of making like is that the way I want it to look? But at least it's functional. At least it does function. That's more than I could have ever hoped for. I first did in here. <laughs> but you know what they say. First is the worst. It's an unfortunate truth, but that's that's the breaks. Them's the breaks. <laughs> but uh yeah, how are you how are you both doing, you two? Oh, there's also a lurk one. But the problem with the lurk is I haven't found a uh uh a good enough sound effect. I haven't found a, a, a sound effect that, like, I think suits a lurking. Oh, hi, Pixie! How are you? Oh, cute, that emo. Oh, my goodness. How are you, Pixie? Is that where you're gonna sit, Teacup? Are you content? Because this way I'm sitting isn't the way I'm gonna be sitting when I start drawing, buddy. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> Teacups. Confetti! I need to find some sort of plugin that just lets confetti rain down. I've got a cutie purring in my lap this year to save me from tears. I'll give it to someone special. Not the kitty. My heart. No one could ever have the kitty! <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> he's just so cute. Merry Christmas, uh, everyone. Merry Christmas, everyone. Once bitten and twice shy. I keep my distance, but you still catch my eye. Tell me, baby, do you recognize me? Well, it's been a year, it doesn't surprise me. <laughs> Just a random Marie Chrysler. <laughs> Betta! Hi, how are you? <laughs> how, how's everyone? How's everyone doing? Hello, everyone. Hi, Lou. Hi, Diggy. Hi, Pixie. Hi, Betta. <laughs> Marie Crisis! Buddy, you can't sit on my lap. This isn't going to be a very comfortable position to be drawing in. You're so very handsome. Extremely so. You're the most handsomest handsome that's ever handsomed. But I'm going to have to move you, buddy. Hello, <laughs> Bada. 
<laughs> oh no. <laughs> Offers a peace kapu. Margaritas, hello! Oh! Congratulations on your graduation! <laughs> oh, uh, for lyric sound effects, uh, sound effect with the Super Mario World Game Over sound effect, where it's kind of sleepy sounding. Super Mario World Game Over, I can't recall what that sounds like. Super Mario World Game Over. I'm street fighting. I'll accept the kapu. <laughs> Gotta keep up the fight. Good fight. Yay, 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 yay. <laughs> Congratulations. Hope you have fun tomorrow. Giggles and hugs, bad. Oh, the peace has been made. Peace has been restored to this to this world. Okay, uh, game over sound effect. Here's one. Let me have a listen. Oh, that is- oh, right! This is a nice- this- that is quite a nice sound for someone taking a break from the stream. Thank you for the suggestion, Pixie. I'll have- I'll- I've got to save this for later. Uh, bookmark lurk, SFX. Toto! Oh, sorry. <laughs> Toto Q. Da -da, da -da 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 -da. Oh, sorry, uh, uh, teacup. Okay, you're gonna have to move, buddy. The art stream's gotta, gotta art. Let me put you on your- I put the tower here just for you. Just for you, buddy. Oh, there you go. Good job, buddy. <laughs> uh, apply your shampoo and conditioner. Good job. Okay. Ta-da. Full of soup, full of soup, full of soup, soup. Shampoo? Yeah, just like when they start, uh, when cats start grooming themselves, especially when they like groom their, uh, they'll lick their paw and then like rub their paw on their head. It's like they're, it's like they're putting on some shampoo, you know? <laughs> that's, that's their version of shampoo. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> and cologne too. That's their cologne. Soup, 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 soup. Hey, yeah. Uh, Axel graduate. Gra 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 graduation. <laughs> Congrats for getting us. Congrats on the grad. Graduation. Congratulations. Congratulations! <laughs> yeah, tomorrow. Awesome. <laughs> I would like some soup. Same here. I would also like to be playing Tekken. For some reason, I really want to play Tekken right now. I've only ever played Tekken Tag Tournament. Two? Or, wait. Tekken Tag Tournament. Which one was the version I played? I have it over there, but I can't, t I can't go see it right now. Tekken Tag Tournament. Got a party. We must. Those are the rules. Oh no, just regular second tag tournament. Okay, not two. Yeah, it was the, it was the the first Tekken tag tournament. All I know is Tekken three. All I know is Tekken tag tournament. But for some reason, I want to start the Tekken series. <laughs> but that's not what this stream is about. Okay, uh, I should, I should, I, uh, uh, hi. <laughs> uh oh, K Monk, log in. <laughs> that violence craving slowly rising, slowly but surely. Full of soup, I want soup and violence now. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
And I crave lots of violence I crave soup I crave soup And violence oh, Hang on, my keybunk It's gotta... Okay Pardon the void Keybunk Uh, keybunk is not connected Okay Back to not the void Welcome to the not the void <laughs> Welcome, welcome to no longer the void. Not the void. Not the not the void. My worst nightmare, not being in the void. Oh, where's the? There we are. Soup, often made with meat and broth. Those are gained through violence. Thus, soup can be set, can said to be violence. You can commit violence by throwing hot soup at someone for violence squared. A perfect duo. It all, it all connects. Everything I do is with violent intent. Just, just be, just be aware of that. Be, be aware and be aware of that. Wait, is be, is beware? I guess beware is kind of like a portmanteau of be aware. Yeah, I think. I don't know if that's the, pr the proper origin of the, the word, but if it was, that would make sense to me. Beware. Be aware. Beware is that pretty much, yeah. Huh. Makes sense to me. <laughs> But yes, be beware and be aware. Particularly for the purpose of being cautious. I suppose so. Beware and be aware. Be, be aware and beware. I'm violent. I can't be tamed. Did you all know that a certain user by the name of Margaritas is really, really awesome? Really happy to know them in the online community. Oh, how sweet! But yeah, Mar Mar's pretty cool. And hi, Savannah, how are you? My heart. <laughs> oh, hang on. Uh, do, 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 do. I've got to set that up. I want to see this over there. Okay, that'll work. Ah, so today, emotes. It's like how remove is asking you not to remove it. <laughs> yeah! Oh, oh goodness, I almost knocked my water over. Oops. In, in my, in my haste to retrieve my tea, I almost knocked my glass of well not glass, that's plastic. My plastic of water over. Boink. Okay, take the tea bag out. Re remove the tea bag. Move the tea bag and remove it from the cup. Hard at work with the creative things. Ah. Keep at it. Gambare. <laughs> I, I will attempt to do the same. I'll attempt so very hard. You okay there, buddy? Yeah, you're good. So I want to work on emotes. I will be working on emotes, especially the scuff. The scuff is so very, very, very needed. But also, I've been... Because, like, I want to take commissions. But first of all, I need to make some sort of a commission. Like, I need, like, a, some kind of basis on, like, Hey, this is what I'm capable of. If you want to commission me, this is what I can make. And so I've been also been working on a... VTuber model. <laughs> Just for, like, examples of, like, Hey, this is what I can make. This is what I can rig. She's gonna be like, oh, <laughs> no, so she's gonna be like, um, unicorn. Well, actually, I'm not sure I want to make, like, make her like a proper unicorn or if that horn's just like a, a fraud. I think I just wanted to be like a party hat, <laughs> but she she's like trying to pass it off as a unicorn horn. I'm not entirely sure. This is just kind of, I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing here. 
and also she's gonna have like a unicorn tuber. Yep. I don't know what I'll do with her if I'll like uh make her like an a a, a viable adoption thing or something, or uh, uh, no, uh, 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 adoptable, adoptable. Yeah, maybe me. I'll like or or a giveaway maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know exactly because I I want to just there's this like I had this idea and like okay I made it. Now what do I do with her? I guess I could do a giveaway or something for someone who would like to have such a character. Robot chicken ruin unicorns for me forever. Oh. How so? <laughs> I have an idea of what robot chicken is, but unicorns in particular, you say? Hey, where are you going? Behave wherever you're going. I don't trust that look you've got on your face, buddy. Am I going to have to escort you out? That is not food. <laughs> Which cat is it? Teacup. Usually pretty chill, but today he seems a little more adventurous. Which is scaring me, because I can't keep my eye on him. Where you going, buddy? What are you looking at? I don't trust the way you're acting. Wait, do you see a bug or something? I think I'm gonna have to escort him out, sorry. <laughs> Pardon me a moment, because he's... ...investigating things that I worry about him investigating. These creatures are liable to eat things that are not edible. What are you doing? <laughs> Hang on, sorry. Just uh, just a moment. The creature has been escorted off the premises. <laughs> Always do your best. Oh, uh, okay. Let me catch up to chat. Sorry, because uh, <laughs> Jacob got what he wanted. He just wanted to leave and get some treats. And yeah, he doesn't want to be in my room anymore. He decided he had enough. Robot chicken ruining your going to be forever. Yeah, it's not appropriate. Okay. <laughs> I might do some investigation later. <laughs> Perhaps, maybe, I might. <laughs> okay. Uh, but yeah, I've been trying to figure out some kind of a unicorn design. She's going to be like, um, her design will be inspired by, uh, Con Beto candy, the little star, sugar star candies. And I came up with a silly name, Bon Gato. <laughs> no, cutting corners. 
She's on the border now. No time for tears. The goal is near. I'm trying to shift to a high gear. If I didn't already have a bit too design, oh, your design's adorable, Pixie. Your your design's precious. <laughs> Hello, friend. Hi, baby. How are you? Face it, the pearls out to get me. I don't wanna spend no time, see. I guess all the hype that I can handle was taken care of, yes, when I was little. But let me give you a word of advice. It seems like a waste of time, but it's nice. Best come on the internet. And such a cute, like a, like, cir circuit circus is so cute. And in life, struggle will help you later. No cutting corners. And I'm in a beat. And I'm in a beat. Cause I got the moves. I don't need time to rest. You know I got the groove and also, uh And I will give it my best. Running from east to west. Got the moves, y'all. Digging the groove, y'all. Hippity hop, y'all. Tippity top, y'all. Go on, go on, move on, move on, get on! <laughs> no, cutting corners. She's on the border now. I'm facing all the prowls that'll get me. Facing the prowls that'll get me. Cause I don't really want to spend no time, see. I don't want to spend no time, see. All this hype all around. All this hype from all around. Seems like a waste of time. Seems like a waste of time with Big Sam. Let me tell you, let me give everybody a little something. But let me give you a word of advice. It seems like a waste of time, but it's nice. In life, you just can't keep going around cutting corners. <laughs> Thank you, Serena. I didn't sing. And I'm in a beat. Cause I got the moves I don't need time to rest You know I got the grooves And I will give it my best Running from east to west Got the moves y'all Digging the groove y'all Hippity hop y'all Tippity top y'all Go on Move on! Get up! Oh dear! Thank you! <laughs> Minnie's too cute. I hadn't seen talent. Minnie's to be on Broadway. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Thank you! This, this thing, uh, 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 thank you! <laughs> Thanks to our fabulous performer! That's right. You gotta believe. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> Those. <laughs> Thanks to our fabulous performer, Minnie! <laughs> I especially really like those songs from Umsy Rin Lammy. The, uh, got, uh, gotta move. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, um, what was it? Oh, um, yeah, but this, this unicorn, I'm still trying to figure out an outfit for her. Like, and I'm not sure I want her, that particular hairstyle. I don't know if I want the twin tails or like, more of like a, like MLP, like, uh, just kind of like one side. I don't know. I'm still in the process, but all I know is unicorn, or maybe not a unicorn, maybe just a regular pony that wears a party hat as a horn, and that's where her party magic comes from. Uh, I did like the Lamy songs more in general. Yeah, I think uh, the Lamy songs are more. What's the word that I want to see? <laughs> unicorn cosplayer. Yep. <laughs> It'll just like. I, I want it to be where at some angles you could see uh, the string that attaches the party hat underneath her, her bangs. <laughs> but only when she uh, has her head at a certain angle. 
<laughs> the party had idea sounds hilarious. I, I think it'd be cute. And I don't know what her reaction would be, with, would be to be caught without the, the party hat. Like, oh. Oh, they're going to find I'm a, I'm a fraud. <laughs> or just like, oh. Uh. Yeah, uh, that's that's the magic. It's an illusion. I'm, 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 with my magic spells, I give the illusion that I'm just a regular horse. <laughs> this magic brought to you by, par exactly, Party City. <laughs> Not to hear me. <laughs> But yeah, there's gonna be like some kind of, uh, I want some, like just a barely visible through her hair. The, whatever's attaching her, her horn. And she's gonna have like, um, fairy, I always pronounce the, because I never heard the, the, the words spoken aloud, but fairy gay fashion, very nostalgic to me. I... When I wear it these days, I, I I always wanted to wear it when I was a young lady. I'm like, oh, this is the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen. And it's still very pretty, but I don't know if it suits me. I, I shouldn't be wearing things based on whether they suit me or not, whether, like, how I think I look in them. Just because I like wearing, like, this, I love this. Look, I love these clothes. I want to wear them. So I will wear them. Uh... Here's a little sneak peek at my Pinterest board I've got open here. That she'll be like, <laughs> furry gay fashion highlights! <laughs> furry gay fashion! <laughs> I guess it could be! I could add a bit of a rainbow in there. Actually, I'm not entirely sure what her color scheme will be. All I know is it's gonna have like a, a bunch of stars, like comets, and confeto. I misheard his Pinterest gourd got everyone everyone needs their hearing checked right now. All of you. <laughs> but I'm not one to talk. My hear my hearing is like clinic like yeah, it's been tested. Not great. Had surgery for it. And I had I have tubes in my ears probably for life. Cause my hearing's just not so great with <laughs> on its own. <laughs> but all of you I, I what is it, infectious or something? Get to hearing chat! <laughs> Pinterest Gord! <laughs> no, that's some good lore. Yep, that's that's my lore. <laughs> uh, uh, have I asked how you're doing, Miles? Hi, Miles, how are you? What's your furry gay fashion? <laughs> oh goodness, I have this blanket on my chair and it's too warm for that. I'm gonna throw it. Bleh. It missed the bed. <laughs> I'll just leave it. Reaches into zucchini and pulls out a mood board. Or you just paint on the zucchini a mood board. Just carve into the zucchini your mood. I'm feeling very ink. Wait, hang on. <laughs> this is my gourd. I draw inspiration from it. This this gourd has helped me through some tough times. <laughs> This is the jack lanterns we need. <laughs> I'm doing good, thank you. Making food and saw Boss Baby too. Hope you're well. What you? I, it's good to hear you're doing good. But what do you think of Boss Baby too? <laughs> And what food are you making, if if I may inquire, if I may dive into your life? Suddenly I am filled to the brim with purpose. This is my mood zucchini, my mood gourd.
Let me make it loud and clear. Very visible. It's not just my mood gourd. It's our mood gourd. <laughs> More. <laughs> <laughs> Making vegetarian tikka masala with cauliflower, cashew nuts, and red onion. I've heard of tikka masala before, but I'm not actually familiar with what it is. Uh, tikka masala. Oh, it looks good. Delicious is what it is. It it looks it. I think I heard of Tikka Masala because of the Great British Baking Show where they were like I think I I can I can like hear Paul Paul Hollywood's voice in my head saying Tikka Masala. Tikka Masala. My mom has a crush on Paul Hollywood. <laughs> I just feel like airing out her dirty laundry. <laughs> she thinks he's very handsome. And Boss Baby too. It was mostly watchable. Mostly. Didn't expect Jeff Goldblum. And you should try Tikka Masala. There are so very many foods I had to try someday. Oh, Tikka Masala originated in Britain, so that's probably why. Oh, okay. <laughs> How can we feed you Tikka Masala? <laughs> Uh, let's see. How can we? I, I guess just put some of the some of the tikka masala you're cooking, Miles, into an envelope and ship it my way, and I will try it ASAP. If you went to the post office with an envelope full of something wet and mushy, would they 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 can't accept it, right? They 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 would just be like, "What? Is something wrong with you? Get this out of here." You you couldn't just they would not take it, okay? Uh <laughs> just just curious. I can't imagine they would. I can imagine it. <laughs> It just arrives leaking. <laughs> oh, uh, pardon the mood, Gordon. This is why he's still here. This is the mood board of some uh, inspiration for this unicorn character. <laughs> Only be sure with those men. Her own soggy envelope of Tika Masala. They wouldn't accept it because they'll be jealous. You have to make sure you brought enough for the class. The whole class. And then, only then, will they accept your envelope. If you give them all their own envelopes. Ah, okay. <laughs> See, so yeah, I might be switching back and forth between the, the emotes and uh, this attempt to show off my capabilities of making a VTuber model aside from myself. Because I, I, I think I'm a relatively simple looking model. I don't have very many, you know, there is some really complex stuff out there. Which I don't know if I'm going to be able to do, but I, I at least want to make something with lots of cute accessories just bouncing around. Very animated, very cute. <laughs> if you use one of those envelopes with packing bubbles on the inside, you might actually be able to do it. You, maybe. Maybe if you put like a fragile sticker on it so they know. Oh, are you becoming a pony? Oh no, she's not me. She's just a character I'm making because I had this idea for like unicorn VTuber. I'm just making it more like a, a demonstration of like, hey, this is what I'm, this is what I'm capable of making. So uh, hire me. I want to be a VTuber mama, I suppose. I, I <laughs> the term's a little weird, but I don't mind being one because that'd be kind of cool. Like, hey, I helped, I helped make a VTuber. 
for, for profit. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this is more so like my, an example. I'm going to make an example of her and no one shall ever wrong me again. <laughs> nice, thank you. Uh, but yeah, for now, for now, emotes, because emotes are a top priority. But maybe if I feel like, oh, this emote's not going anywhere anytime soon, I'll switch between, uh, this stuff. Uh, now I've got a... Wait, where's my, where's my color palette? Why do I picture with pastel... That'd actually be pretty cute now that you say that. Why do I picture with pastel braces? That's, that's adorable. Okay, I'm gonna make a note of that. You ever have an idea you think like, oh wow, this is a good idea I just had, and then you, th you think to a second to Google it, uh, and then you realize like, oh, it's already been done. Oh well, because <laughs> that happens a lot where I think like, oh, that's a pretty cute idea I just had there, and then I look it up, it's like, oh, that's, it's already a thing, it's already been a thing. Oops. <laughs> And if they do wrong you, you have a secret trigger to make the model as non to us as possible in an instant. That'd just be punishing myself! <laughs> oh, where's... Oh, the... Oops. The pen is white. Uh... Do -do -do -do. Pass... Oh, lip. Pass... Lip. Pa pastel? Still, braces. Yeah, <laughs> atrocious with writing that yeah, many. Boink. I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure. If this is like the. I guess even if I if I like do get do a giveaway or something or like hey uh or maybe an auction, like an auction like hey. Highest bidder takes her. Can rename them to whatever rename her to whatever they want, but the pro the. The current title, the working title, is Bon Gato, which is just Con Beto with the... with those switched around, yeah? And for short, Punk. <laughs> but yeah, Pastel Brace is such a cute idea. <laughs> Genius. I'm glad you like the Punk. Da, 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 da. Where is the... Oh, why is it? Wait. Oh, oh, okay, never mind. Foolish mistake, Minnie. Foolish. Da, da, da. <laughs> oh, I don't think I finished this thought I had earlier, but also, Krita's, like, uh, mirroring tool, so very helpful. I did, when I was making this current model of me, I, uh, <laughs> I was using paint tool Sai, and so I had to, like, just guesstimate the symmetry. And if, uh, hang on. Uh, be tuber layer. Oh, because it's locked. Lurk. Oh, enjoy your lurk, Savannah! Savannah's gonna take a quick nap. Sweet dream, Savannah. Thank you so much for lurking. Enjoy your lurk. Have a good time working on your, on your work. I should be doing that. I should be working on my work, but instead I'm just demonstrating me... My my lack of symmetry. Uh, flip horizontal. Yeah, I look I look kind of strange. Like, oh, <laughs> my my wool. It's a little off. It's all. Oh, I don't like I don't like when she's not when I'm not following me. Cause I'm horizontal. Uh, no, I don't like it flipped. <laughs> but yeah, there's there's a little bit of a uh, guesstimation that happened here. <laughs> but that soon will be rectified. Well, soon, ish, ish. <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, da, da. Okay. But yeah, pastel braces. Uh, 
All right, we're here, just sitting in the car. I want you to show me if you can get far. Step on the gas. Step on the gas. Step on the brakes. Step on the brakes. Step on the gas. Step on the gas. When I say boom, 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 you say bam, bam, bam. No pause in between. Come on, let's jam. Step on the gas. Step on the gas. Step on the brakes. Step on the brakes. Step on the brakes. Step on the brakes. Step on the gas. Step on the gas. I'm glad you know which way to go, but it ain't gonna stop me. Here we go. Check and turn the signals to the right. Check and turn the signals to the right. Now turn to the right. Now turn to the right. Check and turn the signals to the left. Check and turn the signals to the left. Now turn to the left. Now turn to the left. What was the pin I was using? Whoa ho ho ho! Stop the car! We got an emergency, can't you see? Do you know why we stopped the car? Do I know why we stopped the car? Guess, guess, what, what? Do you know why we stopped the car? Do I know why we stopped the car? Guess, guess, what, what? I forgot to close the door. You forgot to close the door. Mm. Now, just don't forget, this ain't kung fu, come on again. Check and turn the signals to the right. Check and turn the signals to the right. Step on the gas, now turn to the right. Step on the gas, now turn to the right. Check and turn the signals to the left. Check and turn the signals to the left. Now turn to the left, now turn to the left. Do you know why we stopped the car again? Do I know why we stopped the car again? That's because you just got your license. Yes. I only wish it was that easy. Now, just don't forget, this ain't Kung Fu, come on again. I guess this particular video, yeah, because there's usually a pause after this song, so I guess this video left a long pause after the song's over. Okay, now let's work on emotes and bring to life the magic of Party City. <laughs> I'm, have I been to a Party City before? I've heard of Party City. I might not have ever been to a Party City now that I think about it. Do any of you still go trick-or-treating? It's been... So, not that I don't... Well, it's... It's not that you don't want to for the candy. It's just like, oh, I gotta leave the house. <laughs> and also I can't drive so that, like, I wouldn't wanna, uh, like if I could, if I, I suppose if I could drive and take myself to where I gotta go, then I would, but I'd have to, no, I'd have to ask, can you? Nah, Uber would be too much. Uber would be too much to <laughs> ask an Uber to take me <laughs> trick or treating <laughs> around every neighborhood. No, that'd be that'd be awful. Never mind. <laughs> you, the party animal, never been to Party City. I know it's a crime, ain't it? It has been a few years. Yeah, same here. And I think the last time I, I was like a little little kid. Nah, uh, uh, yeah, a little lamb. I think like. Yeah, I think I stopped when I was in elementary school. I felt like, oh, this is... Nah. I can't be doing this. <laughs> Call Ubers and ask them for candy! <laughs> uh, hey, I'm your ride. I'm here to pick you up. Oh, no need for that. I'm just here for... You know, uh... Trick or treat. What? Yeah, trick or treat. That's what you called me here for. <laughs> My tea's already room temperature, and there's still so much left. What a tragedy.
Spider. Oh, we don't really have trick or treating here, but it's slowly becoming. Oh yeah, I suppose that's also uh, that's also a thing. Like Halloween is not universal. Yon oh the yawn counter. <laughs> oh, I didn't put it on the screen. Oops, hang on, hang on. Uh, let me get it from this screen. My yawn counter. Pardon me. Uh, do, 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 do. Put it here. Boink. Oh, and I also need to reset it. Uh, reset yawns. And... There we go. Well, let me put it, like... This sleepy sheepy is on one time this stream. Speaking of yawns! <laughs> this song sounds very Christmassy. Chris Christmassy. A lot of Puyo Puyo music sounds very Christmassy. To Chris Christmassy to, to me for some reason, like. It sounds so holiday-ish. I guess because it sounds like there's like bells tolling. I don't know. <laughs> What's your favorite Halloween costume that you've used? Oh, so long ago. Um, what? what? I have a uh, 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 a baby picture of me in a little ladybug costume, which is pretty cute. Uh. What, what were some other costumes I had? I think I had like a... I think I had a Princess Jasmine costume once before. Yeah, I did have a Princess Jasmine costume. Um... Oh goodness, what other costumes? There might be pictures, like some, some photographs somewhere in an album. But I cannot recall. I feel like I, I I was most of my costumes would have been princesses, but I can't recall exactly what princesses. If they were specific like Disney princesses or like Barbie princess or just generic fairy tale princess. F for sure, I was Princess Jasmine for one Halloween. Uh, nope, it's, it's, can't recall. Miles, will you be participating in Halloween and trick-or-treating now that it's, you want to join the trend? You want to join the bandwagon? You could be one of the first. Free candy. <laughs> Is there a trend of old people trick-or-treating? Uh, I wouldn't know. I haven't been outside during a trick-or-treating. I wouldn't know who, who, who these days is trick-or-treating. I don't know nothing about trends. saying I'm old that's what that does appear to be what Margaritas is saying <laughs> yes oh he's not even denying it. that's exactly what I meant did I stutter <laughs> yes you heard me loud and clear <laughs> Mario's. 
Rodriguez. Don't you also count as old by your own standards? <laughs> I do! <laughs> Okay, Miles, it's not it's not from a place of judgment. It's from <laughs> It's just the relatability. I know what you are because I am also you. I don't have a good cry sad emote currently. I need one. <laughs> Old gang. <laughs> Adult Halloween is called going to CBS on November 1st for discount candy. That's my Halloween. <laughs> oh dear, my voice is... <laughs> CBS and Walmart before it's too late. Walmart always runs out of the good stuff. By the time you get there. Always, always. Pardon. <laughs> Don't <laughs> Oh, not that I've already been in alert because my mom called, but Oh, enjoy your lurk! <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh wait, oh no, never mind. I sorry, I I got confused by something. But yep. <laughs> Enjoy your lurks. Uh, nah, not Savannah. It worked. It worked. I just need a, a sound effect for it. I just need a nice sound effect to go along with it. Which will probably... I think that game over sound effect did sound pretty nice. We'll hang out in silence. Okay, enjoy. Thank you so much for lurking. Mm -hmm. Oh, this song's so pretty, and also I'm so yawning. <laughs> well, we didn't have Halloween here. We did have a yearly carnival at school. I remember dressing up as a nun one year <laughs> with lipstick and breasts. Welcome to Furry Gay Fashion <laughs> with Miles. Your host. Da, 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 da. Ah, yes, nuns famed for their lipstick and breasts. Da, 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 World renowned. <laughs> Time to get fabulous. That was a weird moment to zone back into. <laughs> There's always so many occasions like that, like, oh, what what's Minnie, what's happening here? <laughs> I leave for two seconds. Why am I so sleepy? <laughs> Nuns famed for their lipstick and breath. <laughs> oh, Chorokyu. Have I I don't think I've ever told you about I don't think I've ever told you about 
the, the most perfect object in the world. Made just for me. If only I could find it. And purchase it. If only. But this is this is the most perfect object in the whole wide world. I want to witness perfection. Well, it's perfection in my eyes. Perfection is in the eye of the beholder. And I, I do beholden with these hooves. Parappa Turukyu. Turukyu brand Parappa in a car. This is official. This is official merchandise. Turukyu. Parappa. When you look up, I, I, in, in, I, I opened up an in, in incognito tab. Todoku Parappa and my thumbnail for a Todoku video of mine is in the results <laughs> Wonderful that's me Todoku Todoku probably cost a million eBay yeah. Well, well, wait. Oh, and there's also a PJ Berry one. Hang on. This image isn't the, the best quality, but oh, that's oh, that's a pitifully small picture, but okay. <laughs> There's also on the PJ Berry. I need th oh, this one's thirty dollars. Oh wait, the shipping is twenty five dollars. <laughs> Hundred forty eighty. I guess it depends who you're buying it from too. You give Japanese Yahoo auctions a look. I never really I've heard of that, but I never really looked into it very much. Yahoo auctions. Would you have to have like a uh some kind of proxy service or something, or can you just buy directly? Oh, I have a couple of total cute transformers from Amiyami. Oh, cute! That would look adorable, I think. Cute transformers, I think, might be different. Cute transformers. Oh, they are cute. They're so short. <laughs> Oh, uh, Q Transformers is the newer line of Choto Q. Oh, we're learning the lore. Choto lore. Look at those Choto, Choto Transformers. They're so short. <laughs> That's cute. Now you need an even tighter picture of another character riding and coming outside that one. <laughs> yes, there are a few forwarding companies. Uh, shipping and import taxes. That's that's always the case. The one I've used is Bai. I will look into this. Well, not for nail. I can't. Not nail, but just for future reference. One of these days when I'm the most famous VTuber there's ever been. Oh, is this Idolmaster? That I'm seeing here. Is Chorokyu still going? Not sure. I guess in in Q Transformers they they perhaps are. Q Transformer, a portmanteau of Q and Transformers. They seem pretty recent. I'm seeing like vid oh well, videos from 2015 up here. Uh, Chorokyu. Mm -hmm. I wonder if they're still making Chorokyu games. Maybe not. And maybe if they are, they're not being translated. Maybe.
Uh, according to the Turukyu wiki, which I'm so glad exists, turukyu.fandom.com, this category lists all available games within the Turukyu series. It seems like the most recent was the one available on Wii. Turukyu Wii, also known as Penny Racers Party, Turbo Q Speedway. In, in English. Uh... Release date, 2008. Hmm. Oh, okay, let me <laughs> bookmark Bai. Uh, for future shopping reference. Because I want the Chorapa. Chorapa. There is so much Parappa merchandise. There well, not so much, but so much. I want all of it. And it's all so expensive. <laughs> I want the um Jimmy Lamy doll. I want these little crap of vinyl figures. $110 pre owned. Oh, this plush of Peachy Berry is so cute. He's eating a donut. picture. Copy image. There he is. That's cute. Ah, uh, so much Parappa merchandise. Not enough money <laughs> and time to acquire it all. So many cool collectibles out there. All expensive and limited edition. The McDonald's Parappa Blush! Sorry, but he's so cute. He's got these fries and he's so cute. No, uh. This image. Look at him! <laughs> look at that smug look on his face. He's so happy to have his french fries. $80. And that's an... The, the store list, lists it as used condition, overall bad condition, pants are faded. But they're still selling it for $80. Imagine all the parappas just waiting for you out there. All those parappas in need of a good home. But I just can't provide it to them. It's so it's so tragic. Everyone, please help me to fund my Parappa sanctuary so I can give this guy this little buddy here a good home. Look at this Parappa alarm clock. There's also a Lammy one. Yep, that's Parappa already. <laughs> Imagine all the Parappas just waiting for you out there. Waiting, looming in the bushes, testing the locks and windows as you sleep. Hi, Doubles, how are you? <laughs> I got the Parappa Stubbins plush day one. Worth it. Stubbins. Parappa Stubbins. Oh, that one! Day one, you say? When was it real? I, I might have been... Like, itty-bitty when this plush was released. <laughs> Need a Parappa Orphanage! <laughs> Whispering barely audible rhymes. Do you know why we stopped the car? Do I know why we stopped the car? Because money and time is just what we don't have. Where does that battery go? Wouldn't you like to know, other boy? It released in like uh, 2016 or something? I forget. Oh, okay. Up the butt. <laughs> it's probably a compartment in the back. <laughs> it's probably. Let me. Let me verify this. Oh, 
Or maybe it is the butt. Because <laughs> on the back is like a control panel. But nowhere I, I can see to put uh, in insert a battery into. I need a, I need a, I need to provide every parappa a good home. Please help me on my journey. <laughs> Honestly, that would be terrifying if parappa was just whispering somewhere out of sight. <laughs> In the distance, you hear a faint rapping. How shall you proceed? This is the Lammy clock. I said this is the Lammy... Copy the image. There we go, this is the Lammy clock. Her eyes... I think the color might have... Oh, th that's the battery compartment. In the shoes. In the shoes. Not the butt. The shoes. This is not an art stream anymore. This is just me looking at Parappa merchandise. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I, all, I just got caught up in the moment of like, you know... So in arts, yeah, this is a typical art stream business as usual. There's also the Parappa toaster. I don't think I've ever told you about the Parappa toaster too. It, it burns images of Parappa onto your toast. But I've seen, I've, I've seen like, I think the cheapest I ever saw Parappa toaster was like two hundred dollars, which like, okay, I really want this toaster. But <laughs> I'm barking. I, d I would like to have images of Parappa burned onto my toast. But... that That's... You're asking me a lot of it, out of me. And those are like the plates you can burn... You can burn images of his frog, of him, and of Sunny Bunny. It's real cute. It's very, very cute. Official Parappa the Rapper, official Space Age One printing toaster. Have a nice piece of crunchy hot toast. Is Parappa the Star Wars of Japan? I don't know. I don't know uh, exactly what this. <laughs> He's the Star Wars of my heart. <laughs> Japan is actually a marketing campaign for Parappa. Parappa exists solely <laughs> to shill. Wait, did I say Parappa? Japan exists solely to shill Parappa. That's all this was for. That's all it's ever been. Oh! Parappa could have been a rap scallion! This is. The <laughs> oh! Ready to make some far progress with me? <laughs> Hi! I like that bean bun noise. I think that's a good sound for someone saying hello. Bean bun! You only get one per stream. <laughs> we are not making progress right now. We are not ready for progress. But... Some of, his, some of the concept for... He was almost a clam, almost a dinosaur, but he could have been a rapscallion! We very, very nearly had a rapscallion! Oh! Uh, Opaka uh, has arrived and is ready to shine! <laughs> Rapapa Rappa! Hello there, how are you? Opaka, uh, or, uh, yeah, Opaka TC. Hi, how are you? <laughs> oh, speaking of Rappa. <laughs> Woof! He could have been a wolf too. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, other reject ideas. Snip Snip included Foxy Parappa, Parappa Zero, Parappa B, Parappa Clam, and even Parappa Zilla. The dog was the winner and he was continually refined to look at Parappa as we know him today. Just been lurking around. Oh, I hope you're enjoying your lurk. I hope you're enjoying this riveting discussion. Give him my best shot. To oh, wait, no. Um. Smooth with the kick. Listen to the music and keep up the mix. Oh, I know them feels. Hi, Mr. Unpopular. How are you? <laughs> he could have been a rap scallion. I thought it was just. <laughs> save, save, save. Check it out. Cut the cut. Snip the snip. Cut the spot. Snip the snip. Trim the trim. Shave the shave. Oh, wait! Pa -pa -pa oh, I thought that was just a joke! <laughs> that is. Oh, look at how cute. You see, now, I don't have time to lose. My customers keep coming in and out. Many demands for people alike. I know what cutting hair is all about. Trim, trim, cut. Cut, trim, trim. Burn, burn, cut. Cut, burn, burn. Working reading as, uh, as per usual. Your work lets you read while you work? Nice. Give him my best shot to keep myself red hot Cause I'm the one to bring out the original Flavor, flavor for my people, people Come on kids, last shot for the final With the shampoo, I'll give it to you all With the shampoo, you'll give it to me all Rinse it good, I made you look tall Rinse it good, you made me look tall Dry your hair, blow up and down Dry your hair, blow up and down Come on son, it's time to get down Come on son, it's time to get down Keep the line, keep the line moving Keep the line, keep the line moving I'm non-stop, my body's just grooving I'm non-stop, my body's just grooving Cut your hair, flat back and up front Cut your hair, flat back and up front Give you a perm now, and we're done Give you a perm now, and we're done New Redeems just noticed Oh yes! Hello world! Hey. Let's give Miles Baxter a warm woolly welcome. <laughs> Bing bong! I'm not sure about the placement of it, and I'm not sure that's the way I want to keep it, but at least it works. Wait, wait a second. I just noticed. Have they all been my, my icon? It's supposed to be the icon of the user who redeems the... Have they all been just my donut? <laughs> Hang on, could someone redeem that for me? That's just my i. It's supposed to be the icon of the redeemer. Oh no, I did not notice either. No. Well. Oh, oh thanks for and thanks for the redeem, Jules. For for. <laughs> It's supposed to show the icon of the person who redeems it. We are all cinnamons. <laughs> I suppose that's fitting. I'm mini. You're mini. We're all mini here. <laughs> the icon of the redeemer sounds like some hardcore ancient artifact to me. <laughs> I'll never recover financially from this transaction. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Mr. Unpopular says this is where I watched my parents die for Appa. This is where I watched my hopes and dreams die for Appa. <laughs> oh dear, I had to fix that. Uh. Well, I, I could fix it later, but still. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. da. Well, hmm, <laughs> I really didn't notice it was all just my crawler. Is it because I didn't name it correctly? How do I set it up to where? Do -do 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 -do. Still very cool, thank you. Very cool, very cool, very cool. Uh... 
It's 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 all a work in progress. It's all a work in progress. Progress, which are we are not making right now, because I'm so caught up in the in the papapo rapa. I struggled with that too on my own setup. Yeah, it's all trial. I suppose it's all trial and error, and it's hard to quite figure things out. Like, how will this work when other people redeem it? I guess we'll just have to. We gotta test it out in the field. <laughs> Oh, let me get to the chat, sorry. Uh, it's kind of funny how the concert art looks like scribbles from a 10 year old. No, don't you- nah! <laughs> I see- I kind of see what you mean. I, uh, Mr. Greenblatt just has this- I think it's very charming, his art. I really, really like his art a lot. But I kind of see what you mean about, like... I guess it's kind of like, uh... Very, like, childlike whimsy to it. I don't know. They're all very cute. I like his art a whole bunch. <laughs> the icon of the Redeemer. <laughs> the real question is, how did Claire fare at the arcade? How did Claire fare at the arcade? L l let's take a quick look before we get back to work. <laughs> Capcom and Namco have teamed up to create a uh, bio... Hazard, Fire Zone, an arcade gun shooting game based on the Resident Evil series. Shown here is Cap Capcom's mock-up sketch of the actual cabinet. In the game you play as Claire, and your mode operandi is the same as usual. Kill all zombies. Like Resident Evil Survivor for the PlayStation, you are able to roam free freely around using the level- Uh, bleh. Freely around the levels. Roam freely around the levels using the light gun as a controller. The game is just about finished with location testing in Japan and should hit the arcade soon. We could build our own game? That I'm also curious about. God, that arcade cabinet looks old school. This is old school. What year is this? Wait, one of our favorite developers, Art Dink, known for highly unconventional games like Tale of the Sun, Carnage Heart, and No One Can Stop Mr. Domino. Those sound interesting. Why haven't I heard of these? Ah uh, yes, Resident Evil Survivor. That's gonna, <laughs> that's really gonna get him excited. <laughs> Tale of the Sun. These sound intriguing. Unconventional games. I love un 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 unconventional games. Tale of the Sun. Huh. This looks cute. We can. This looks. They look. This looks very simple. But also extremely cute. If, if only I could let me show the image. Cartoon caveman. Cartoon caveman. Look at those character models. How cute. I don't know what this game's about, but I, I'm, I'm adding this to my list because it looks adorable. This game looks... I don't have the slice idea what's going on here. <laughs> Adorable apparently potato PS1 graphic cave people! They're cute cave people! Very small, look how small she is! And still cute! Uh, not, not despite the soul, but even with yeah, I don't- yeah, she's cute. <laughs> Tale of the Sun is a quirky, artsy caveman simulator released in 1996 for the PlayStation. I want to play the caveman simulator. I need to simulate that meat on the bone. <laughs> Gotta be swole to survive. <laughs> you must be swole. Mr. Unpopular says you gotta do what? You gotta be swole. You gotta do what? You gotta be swole. Da -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Caveman Simulator from 1996 is a very mini kind of game. I think so too. I think this is this is meant for me. Survival of the Swollest, exactly. This game has been called a spiritual su successor to Art Dink's earlier non-game 
Aquanauts Holiday. I, 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 okay, I think I need to check out Aqua Dink, Art, Aqua Dink, Art Dink's, like, entire, uh, not discography. What's, what's, like, because you call it disc discography of music. What's, like, a, I don't know, portfolio of games, because this, these all sound intriguing. Aquanauts Holiday. Aquanaut no Yujitsu. Underwater simulation in which the player assumes the role of an overworked marine explorer who returns to the water for pleasure after having bought harmony to having brought harmony to the world's oceans. Huh, so you're just like an aquanaut taking a vacation. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> The, the game has no time limits, enemies, or other obstacles. The game's objective, aside from exploring, is to build a large coral reef to attract a wide variety of fish and other marine wild- This sounds perfect! This is not an art stream! <laughs> studying references art I guess oh it's very it's not like sty uh is this all the same game or is this some kind of like this game looks really advanced for if this is the correct game I'm looking at here oh was it re-released maybe this is high art, challenging our preconceptions of what art truly is. We're getting deep here. I want the PS1 version. That's what I'm talking about. Look at this sea dragon. Oop, big image. That is a nice sea dragon. I'm gonna save. I might play this over this. But when's is, has summer already started? Is it summer? When when's? Because I have a collection of games I want to play during the summer. It's summer, right? It's summer. Okay. Uh. Oh dear. <laughs> That's a nice dragon right there, ain't it? It's beautiful. It's art. This is. It's, I'm not creating art, but I'm looking at art. We're all looking at art right now. Is looking at Parappa, Parappa Collectibles art? What, why are we to say? Who are we to say if Parappa Collectibles just viewing them is or is not art? Okay, Aquanauts Holiday PS1. Adding that to my summer list. Uh... Wait, what was I? Okay, the caveman, the cave, the cave people. <laughs> okay. Let me finish reading this article before I look the, up the, the rest of those games. Uh, created utility software called Basic Studio for the PlayStation 2 that allows amateur programmers to create their own games. Oh, and interesting. How I've never heard of this before. Basic Studio requires the new PlayStation 2 hard drive, the PS2 HDD unit, plus a keyboard and mouse. Basic Studio comes with a polygon crafting tool, a texture mapping utility, a song composer, and the easy basic programming tool. Included in the software are several s sample textures and models from various art games like Carnage Heart to give you a head start. The program comes packaged with two PS2 discs, the Basic Studio disc and the Play disc. By storing your game on the 8 megabyte memory card, you can show off your new creation to your friends by loading it with the Play disc. This is an incredible piece of software and is not limited to exclusive users like the original PlayStation's Yeroze program. We hope they can spread the love of aspiring game creators out there in the US. It's like RPG Maker kind of. Yeah, I wonder what creations exist out there. I suppose... Well... If people, I, I've always wondered how the prog the process of putting a ROM, like, okay, I've got this game on CD, a PlayStation game. How do you take that and put it in a playable format on a computer? I've always wondered, like, how do people make this, this stuff? I wonder if this could be emulated and then, like, the creations then turn into ROMs that are compatible with other emulators so you could spread that game. Like, interesting. But 
but there's probably some creations out there like that we'll never know. Someone probably made something real wonderful with it, and we'll just never know. A lost art. <laughs> okay. Okay, let me look up Carnage Heart real quick. Carnage Heart. Tail the Sun. I'm adding that to my. Oh, and, oh right. I have pro I have like a proper book. Uh, my rank one profile. A uh, tale of the sun. Add that. And Aquanauts Holiday. Oh, oh, thank you for the take care. I should, I'm, I'm sitting kind of weird. Hello, world. Hop aboard the crazy bus, Bada. <laughs> Don't mind that my icon is there. I, I'll fix that someday. Someday, somehow. Emulating a game maker for PlayStation on PC to make a game and then emulate that one is weird enough to, call me, to be called art. <laughs> There's lots of complexity here. So very many complex complexities here. You just can't understand art. The way I see it. Oh, my tea is probably cold. Cold! <laughs> yes. It is time to get romantic. Time to get romantic. Yes, indeed, that's for sure. The kick punch style remains very secure. Never pending, always the first to make a move. This time we get down nice and smooth. Love, Kate. Dan always says Lulu. Where Lulu the Colonel Pound? <laughs> Lulu, you there? Hang on, uh, okay, la I, okay, let me close this out, just because this is going to keep happening. Close that out. But, on the Wikipedia article of, uh, Tale of the Sun, because I'm smooth, with the group so new, I wish everybody had the same point of view. Meet me at the corner, pick you up a seven, wear your best dress and I'll take you to heaven. Why'd you bonk me? Why'd you bonk me? Okay. I just want to read this development, uh, article, d uh, under the development title on the Tale of the Sun wiki page. This, uh, caveman simulator. Uh, Tale of the Sun was developed, developed by Arctic and directed by, uh, Kazutoshi I uh, I Ida. When developing this game, Ida wanted to make the anti-Mario game, explaining that the enjoyment of Super Mario Bros. derives from the action rather than the premise of saving Princess Peach. Ida was wowed by Super Mario 64, as the exploration of a 3D space was what they were aiming for with this, and using the same methods. However, he felt that a character like Mario... Oh wait! It's impossible to imagine a game without a happy end! Wanting to make a game without a happy ending... Oh no! The anti Mario, so you in prison, Peach? Caveman Peach. Cablewoman Peach. Wait. <laughs> Hang on. Ida designed the game with a counterintuitive approach at times, citing how the player character would intentionally or intermittently fall asleep during the action. Ida believed that this made the parts where the character was awake more entertaining as a result. Ida discussed how he feels suspicious about claims that a game must be fun to be a game! <laughs> Arguing that time that games like Crazy Climber and Frogger were not really fun and exaggerately expressing a desire to create an unfun game. <laughs> I want to be miserable during this game. That is my goal. <laughs> That's great! 
<laughs> There's many games that are just depressing these days. Oh, tell me about it. <laughs> he intentionally set out to make a bad game. <laughs> Unfun. Counterintuitive. A game doesn't have to be fun to be a game. Okay. <laughs> I, I, this makes me want to play it more. I am so interested, intrigued of how this. Like, what do you mean? You, what do you mean? You deliberately made a game unfun. Let me see how much, how little fun I can derive from this experience. If I want unfun and counterintuitive, oh God, science. why, why do that when you can have the com You can have unfun. Counterintuitive, unfun in the comfort of your own home. <laughs> okay, let's make the anti Mario unfun and counterintuitive. This is what I desire, this is what the people want. And we're gonna give it to them. If I want unfocused and counterintuitive, I'll watch any cinema stream. <laughs> That's what you're getting here. That's what I've got for you. But I'm glad you didn't say un unfun. At least there's that. At least there's that. <laughs> I need to find some place. Uh, so, uh, do you hear snoring? Oh, it's Miles. Sweet dreams, Miles. Enjoy your lurk, Miles. <laughs> oh, Jubbles is lurking too. Ah, oh, looks like Jubbles is reclining on that cloud over there. Sweet dreams, Jubbles. <laughs> if it's the anti Mario, and Mario is the plumber, is the game used entirely clogging up a toilet with your bell? <laughs> Oh, Buzzy Dragon Books is here for the pajama party. Hello, hello. How are you, Buzzy Dragon Books? <laughs> is this what ABGN has been looking for? You know what? Maybe. I want... I want to see his reaction to it. Like, they made this... They wanted this to be unfun. And you know what? They succeeded. Or you know what? This is a pleasant surprise. Hi, Buzzy, how you doing? But yeah, someday soon I need to play <laughs> Tale of the Sun because it the idea of a, of, of, a of, a, of a game made as unfun as possible intrigues me very much and the fact that it's caveman little cute little cartoon caveman intrigues me very, very much so too Oh, what's... Something's up with my mouse. Oh wait, no, I see what's wrong. I see what I'm doing wrong. Having fun watching your stream. Oh, I'm glad. I heard those fuzzy dragon butts. Goes back to lurk. Get to your jet. <laughs> You're only hearing what you want to hear, Miles. Okay, back to work, back to work. This is an art stream. I gotta give the people what they came here for. You gotta give the people what they want. Miles wants to hear butts? Yeah. Right, Miles? Well, he's lurking. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, how, how's it how, uh, <laughs> how's it going, Fuzzy? I hope you're doing well, and I hope you're enjoying the stream. I'm, I'm trying to get back on track. I'm trying so very hard. <laughs> Mm 
This derail the derailment was all my fault. I just got so caught up in the Toto queue and Parappa queues. Torappa. It was so cute. I looked at gameplay of uh, Tale of the Sun and something alright. <laughs> I think I want to keep it as a Well, yeah, I'll try and go in as blind as I can. I want to I want to go into the unfun blind. <laughs> it's something alright. <laughs> I can't wait to see that something. I look at uh, a couple seconds only so I'll be semi blind. <laughs> I can't wait to see what all the unfun's about. I am focused. I am normal. What time is it? Uh, 4.45. Uh, let's say... Four... In five minutes, I'll take a break, because it's, it's, it'll be, it'll have been, uh, like... Yeah, a while since I've had a, uh, since we had a break. <laughs> Talking about Parappa merch and obscure games that are intentionally made to be bad. Takes a lot out of you. And gourds. And carving your anger into gourds. It's all, it's all a lot to take in. It's very exhausting. Speaking of exhausting... <laughs> May I need like a violence week? Like I just play like a, a, a when did I do that? Like I, I had the collection of spring mini games like the Garden of Calm and uh, Hanami, where we just like, played some games with a spring a spring flair to them that I thought were cute. And I, I want to do that with summer too, but I guess I could also do that with like Tekken and Tale of the Sun. Because apparently Tale of the Sun has an unhappy ending. So that's something. <laughs> Violence Week, let's go! <laughs> Let me hear you say ho! Say ho! Ho! Mortal Kombat! <laughs> Mortal Kombat song, like, the theme song. It's party time, come on everybody. You can do it, shake your body. It's party time, come on everybody. You can do it, shake your body. Come on out on the floor. And rock it till you want some more. Come on out on the floor and rock it till you want some more. Wave your hands from left to right. Feel the rhythm, enjoy the ride. Wave your hands from left to right. Feel the rhythm, enjoy the ride. Yeah, yeah, I know the people are rocking. The night is young and we go non stopping. People up front, people way back. Come on, y'all, let's rock this shack. One, two, three, four, and five. Come on, everybody, look alive. <laughs> Come on, everybody look alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Everybody dance hard till the end. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Everybody dance hard till the end. MCs, DJs, dancers, and artists, we're all in the same big boat. Let's shout, cause I'm the MC and you're the crowd. You better enjoy it right about now. He's back again, the young pup on the block, taking every problem one by one. 
Doesn't cut corners, he never gives up, that's why he's always the number one. Doesn't cut corners, he never gives up, that's why he's always the number one. A hero lives in a neighborhood, he has to be clear cause he's a tough little kid. Always believing, never retreating, but rap is the name and it'll give you a fix to all the brothers and the sisters. <laughs> All the mothers and the fathers We all have problems, no doubt for sure But tonight let's forget and unite People in the front, people in the back Side to side, let's all get down I see a party in front of me, that's what I like Party over here, party over there The night's still young, so grab your partner Here we go, y'all, all night long If you got a problem, what you gonna do? If you got a problem, what you gonna do? Give it up or believe in yourself Give it up or believe in yourself If you got a problem, what you gonna do? If you got a problem, what you gonna do? Like Parappa, you gotta believe Like Parappa, you gotta believe Say ho, ho, say ho, 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 ho Say ho, 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 ho Now scream! Say all right, all right Say oh yeah, oh yeah What you gonna do? What you gonna do? I gotta believe, I gotta believe Say all right Say oh yeah What you gonna do? I gotta believe <laughs> BRB looking up the most violent games for you to play <laughs> Doom Eternal Mortal Kombat <laughs> It surely was I hope you all had a great time too Those are Mortal Kombat, the theme song to Mortal Kombat, it slaps. I will also change my playlist accordingly for Violence Week. The Mortal Kombat theme song, uh, I guess just fighting game soundtracks. It does slap. <laughs> Those new Mortal Kombat games go real about the violence. I imagine they would. Just keep ramping it up. When did I say I was going to take a break? 4.55? I think that's what I said. Or did I say 50? Was it like 4.45 and I said like, I'll take a break at 4.50 and now it's 4.50 and I'm like, what? Did I say that? I don't remember what I said. <laughs> oh well. I guess I'll wait till 4.55. <laughs> three minutes from now, Minnie. Three minutes from now. Just go until 5. Yeah. Yeah, five. <laughs> a nice even number. Say all right, say oh yeah, what you gonna do, I gotta believe. Oh, I guess Cubivore could technically, like, Cubivore, I've heard, uh, it's this... I guess that could... It's not... Vi... Well... Is it violent? Well, not really. It's not like blood and guts. It's just, you know, cubivore. You are a carnivore. A cube carnivore. And you must consume... The creatures that are weaker than you. But you're also a cute little cube-shaped critter. But I would like to play Cubivore, so maybe I could say that for Violence Week. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I'm looking at the video of the fatalities in the new Mortal Kombat game and damn, <laughs> they go that hard? Look at this cute little cute pig. <sighs> I am born. I am alive. They sure do. <laughs> Oh, here's a better quality image. Because this is pretty badly pixelated. Oi, oi. The realistic graphics go a long way. They gotta use every... <laughs> they gotta use all the technology at their disposal. In the search of... In the search for this screen cap, I came across a Twitter for obscure games aesthetics. I like it. I like it. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. <laughs> This pig screams at my soul. In a good or a bad way, is it a pleasant scream? Is it a pain scream? I like this pig. But yeah, me. <laughs> I do want to play Cube on stream. It's just a constant, endless scream. That's all I can gather from this. In I have nothing more to tell you. It just screams. That's all I know. Look at it. <laughs> Look at it. Look at it. Now, three minutes until we take, we take a break. Break, break, break time. And then maybe I'll come back less distracted. Maybe. But it's unlikely. Yeah, so many games to play, and now I have to, like, categorize them in such a way, like, well, not have to, it's just, like, it'd be nice to, like, theme them, like, oh, this, this would be good to play in the summertime, I think. Uh, should probably not stay up too long today, so I'm not zombie much more. Oh, yes, you should get your rest, so you're prepared. So you're feeling refreshed and ready to party, party, but not too hard. Not so much that you that to feel bad, but enough to feel fun. I don't know. I don't know. I've never been to such a party, so I wouldn't know. But yeah, go ahead and rest up. Be prepared and have a fun, have a lot of fun tomorrow. Da -da 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 -da. 
This week we play psychologically traumatizing games. <laughs> yeah, if I can like keep it condensed, get your therapist ready. If I can keep the themes condensed in the one week that I can let everyone know, like, okay, this week will probably scar you, but if you're not into that, come back next week. I'll have I'll have some uh I'll play some uh, old PC games of My Little Pony and Care Bears. I really wish I was playing Tekken right now. <laughs> One of these days soon I need to play Kirby, uh, Kirby's Adventure. Before October so I can play the Halloween mod of it because it looks super cute. And also I just need to catch up to the Kirby series in general and also the Mario series and ah, so much. I hope I can finish Sunshine before the summer's end. Because I think it'd be start ni nice to start on Galaxy. Within the year. So that next year I could... Maybe, maybe next year. Because I, 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 I want to play Odyssey. I want to know what's, what's up with Odyssey. Odyssey, you see? And so if I could start off the next year with my first Mario game being Odyssey, that'd be pretty cool, actually. That'd be pretty neat. Hi. Oh, thank you for the take care. Oh, speaking of take care, break time. <laughs> I will go ahead and stretch and refill my water with some ice, because it's... Have I taken a... I have not taken a sip of water this whole stream. Oh, sorry. I, I think I bumped my mic with the cup. Needs ice. <laughs> okay, let me save. And yeah, let's all take a break to stretch. Get some something to drink. Oh. Streamer, no sippies. This is the worst possible. Oh wait, maybe I did, cause I think someone redeemed a, a take care earlier. But maybe I forgot to do the the hydrating part of the take care. Oh dear. <laughs> But I'll, I'll, I will, I will, I will resolve this. I will add some ice to my water, and I will be hydrated, and so very cool. But yeah, let's all take a break. It's been a while. Feel free to grab yourselves a snack, a drink, whatever you desire. Uh, and yeah, I'll be, I'll be right back to you. Gotta go stretch. Gotta go sip. BRB.
Okay, I'm back. Oh, check your Discord when you're back. Okay. Huh? Get violent. <laughs> I was fully expecting just a, uh, some sort of a Sigma or Ligma joke <laughs> or, or Slugma. I just thought you would be like, hey, check your Discord, and you would, I would just, I would just have like a message of Slugma. <laughs> but uh, thank you very much for whatever this is. Sadly, I did not think of that. <laughs> well, now you, now you have that. I am shamed. <laughs> Anyway, put that in Steam. Okay, uh... Let me have a look at that. Uh, Steam's updating. Oh, uh, wonderful. It has to update, like, every day. What? what? Why does it look so different? What is... Oh, you got the new update, finally. Oh, wait, no, wait, no, it looks... Okay, it doesn't look that different. Uh... Oh, uh, <laughs> hang on. Um, oh, wait, yeah, it does kind of look... There, there are differences I am noticing as I explore. Oh, but I don't, I don't want to explore. I want to redeem. Link. Confirm. Take it! <laughs> Thank you! Thank you very much, my amigas. I'm gonna have to work my way up to this violence, though. <laughs> I was also wondering, no problem, thank you very much. I was also wondering, with that code captioned get violent, I was expecting like some kitty game, like, like let's learn our ABCs. <laughs> that would have also, that's also a missed opportunity for a slugma and for the game to just be like, ABCs with Lady the Pooh or something like that. <laughs> Thank you very, very much. One of these days. Tekken. God, I'm a failure. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> Just a couple of missed opportunities is all. But thank you very, very, very much. <laughs> How could I have been so blind? <laughs> but yeah, one of these days I will catch up to Tekken lore. Ah, uh, crap, there was a bundle with a game called Lesbian Animal RPG that would have been perfect for this! <laughs> it would have been one <laughs> How have I not heard of such a thing before? Super! Super lesbian animal RPG.
I must look for- Okay, no, no distractions! No distractions! Uh. Okay, bookmarking! <laughs> No looking at must be it's only art. No looking at art, only creating art. That's what this stream is for. What I mean? <laughs> uh, nothing major. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> Me trying my very best to not get distracted. <laughs> well, that's that's every stream. Especially every art stream. It's just so easy. I'm so susceptible to Google. Google has a grip on me. How are you? <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, 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 Sour gummy worms probably aren't loud enough to be noticed if I were to chew one on stream, right? Right? Because I've got this bag of sour gummy worms. <laughs> oh, uh, but I hope you're doing well despite the eepy sheepy, eepy sheepiness, eepy eepiness sheepiness. I hope you're doing well despite the eepy sheepy. Probably not. Probably not. Let's let's. Ah, only one way to find out. <laughs> Let me crank my volume up and check. Please do inform me. I'm getting self conscious about my doing things. <laughs> I don't hear you chewing. Okay, good, 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 good. <clears throat> gummy worms. Sour gummy worms. Safe. Yeah, I'm doing good. I think it's post-convention blues selling, uh, selling in, to be honest. Oh, okay, good to hear you're doing good. You're safe, unlike almonds. Unless you activate them first. Oh, is that my... Oh, two more left. Two, two remain. I will savor them. But, uh, may I ask what kind of convention it was, if you, if you feel like sharing. I hope you had a good time at that convention. Sour gummy moons are awesome. The best. The best. I think the only sour um uh, sour candy I really like at all is uh sour gummy worms. Usually I'm not one for sour, but something about the sour gummy worms, the texture, the Yeah, they're good. <laughs> it's a localish convention called SunnyCon. Cute. Uh typical anime gaming type deal. With lots of artists, trader tables with really cool things. SunnyCon. <laughs> I remember Micah read me with that giant gummy worm. <laughs> I remember it too. It was it was it was vile. It was disgusting. <laughs> I 
I hear those are awful. I I suppose if you had to have like such a big, big hunk of gummy, that the texture is probably gonna be compromised. <laughs> have to massage it first. I remember. <laughs> yep. You gotta massage it. You gotta tenderize it. But Sunnycon, Sunnycon sounds. I like the, even the name sounds cute. But I hope you had a fun time. Were you cosplaying, or were you just attending and having a good time? Okay, one one gummy worm. Let me drink some water. <clears throat> and savor my final worm. It's the final worm now. Do 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 <laughs> that concludes that. Did it do 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 Hopefully you can make like some, uh, well, yeah, uh, too warm to cosplay. I can only imagine like having to wear a costume in certain temperatures does not sound fun. But maybe your old cos, your old uh, cosplay could be adjusted. <laughs> Minnie, why do you not have Darude Sandstorm in your playlist? <laughs> Good question. I should have, I should have put that in. Well, I, I guess it's only because I, all, all my. My playlist is just entirely video game soundtracks. Darude Sandstorm, to my knowledge, has not been featured in any video game. I, I try to play extra safe by only playing games, only playing songs that are from games, so I can, I can like have, like, oh, the so it, it's it's video game music. Don't be upset with me. I'm streaming video game music on Twitch. Just the one non-game track. <laughs> but good point. Wait, one. I have one that's already not game? Which one? Oh, some absolute mad lads and they were in full first first I can only imagine the f <laughs> or leather costumes. I envy their sheer willpower. They gotta stay high No, I mean just have to stay <laughs> okay, like hypothetically. If Saint Storm were in there, the only non video game soundtrack song to be featured. <laughs> If if copyright were not a fact factor, I'd be playing so much J-pop you wouldn't believe. We'd be listening to Wasita, so much Wasita, nothing but Wasita, <laughs> or the world standard for for full. Oh my goodness, a fur suit in this in these temperatures. I hope those those suits are conditioned, like air conditioned, with a like a like a vent. Or would you put the vent in a fur in a fur suit? Good question. I don't know. I don't make those. I I don't do that for a living, or at all. Not even as a hobby. Da <laughs> 
Oh, I should I should shut off Steam if I'm not gonna be using it already. That's already done with. Blink. Uh, some do have tiny fans in their suits, but not sure how much they help. I I can only imagine how 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 like how how much how much does it help? Only so much. I don't know. <laughs> it's because like I don't think I'd even. I've always thought, like, I want a cute suit. I, well, I've thought about, like, oh, I'd like to, it'd be nice to have a cute little suit for a suit. They kind of look like you need a full AC set up in there. That's what, like, yeah. Cooling vests? Cooling vests are a thing, too. Huh. I'd imagine having, uh, even having a tiny bit of airflow in the suit is better than nothing. But yeah, like, even then, I don't think I could manage... Even, even if it was like, just like the weight of a fursuit on you, I don't know if I could, I could, I don't know if I could, with, I don't think I have the willpower to withstand such a thing. Maybe we're an oxygen tank. <laughs> oh, okay, cooling vest. Interest, interesting. Just two cat ears, cat ears. That's enough for me. <laughs> Thank you. I remember thinking, um... Minnie would immediately collapse. <laughs> but I would, I suppose, a fursuit pile on the ground just. <laughs> Why isn't that fursuit moving? Who just who just left their fursuit here? Oh, there's a there's someone in there. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ooh, lag. <laughs> I'm a, I'm especially fond of um like, I really like uh, the kimono style of fursuits. Kimono. They're really cute. And also, uh, Budoland Sanrio mascot costumes are just the cutest little things. And I think to myself, I, I could manage. I could do it. If only to be so cute. Oh god, I thought of another game that would have been hilarious to gift with Get Violent, but it would have been inappropriate to say the least. Oh dear! <laughs> there's an awesome kimono dancer. I've seen a couple. I've seen a couple of, uh, well, not a couple, but there's one particular I think of. I think their persona was a. Shetland dog? Or something like that? But yeah, I don't know how you could do all that, like, all that, even that, like, all that movement in that suit. I hope, I hope the person when they're done with their dance covers takes that off immediately. <laughs> I think the, the, the dancer I'm thinking of had, like, a, I think they were a dog. Title in Discord. Okay, okay. That one. <laughs> Likely more than one uh person who does uh, dance covers. What's what's the Japanese term? Odotemita. Uh. Yeah. Uh. You also have to exaggerate the movements a lot in a first suit, so even more work. Yeah, like you have to make sure those those expressions are conveyed in your movements. You gotta. Yeah, you gotta exaggerate it. Uh. Okay, yeah, there is there are a couple. But there was one in particular that I saw, I was like, this is so cute. <laughs> D 
just do an interpretive dance for everything. <laughs> My interpretive dance is I, I just stand here. That's an interpretation. Uh, Odo Temita. Odorite. Kemono. Hi, how are you? <laughs> or strike Jojo poses. <laughs> I might have the video saved somewhere on some playlist on some account <laughs> somewhere out there Ah, I found the one I was thinking of. Oh, okay. If I can remember who it was I'm thinking of, then I'll share. Hmm? <laughs> I'm sorry, the, the, <laughs> the caption. Pick a struggle. <laughs> but what a cute... Oh my goodness. Such a cute suit and also very good dancer. I hear cars going by very, very loud, very, very loud. Do, 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 Uh, I know I saw their videos on YouTube. They, I may have to find the proper search terms in Japanese to find them again. Or may have it in like a search history of one of my YouTube accounts. Somewhere. I don't know. But it was super. I'll, I'll, if I could find it, I'll share it in like uh, the Discord or something, maybe. Ah, but on end. Boink. Do, do. Do, 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 do. <laughs> in the deepest hiccup of <laughs> in the deepest bowels of Minnie's history <laughs> somewhere in there there is evidence of me the secrets of dance I uh actually did you hang on it's 
do, do. Uh, I don't, th I don't believe I've ever talked about um, overseas idols before on my on my stream. But gosh, Starn was I obsessed with them and also J like J-pop idols and overseas idols, which are like, f well, some of them are K-pop inspired, but uh, uh, several were pretty much J-pop inspired. But I got very obsessed with that, and I was like, I'd, I'd like to do that. I'd like to do dance covers and song covers and be like an overseas idol. But um, no. <laughs> but uh, hang on. But instead, I decided, you know, I'll. I like the work these idols are doing. I will support them. I got I like overseas. Yeah, like uh, overseas from Japan, cause like Japan was like the biggest inspiration of like like J-pop idols. Overseas idols are like um, inspired by Japanese idols, but they're they're not Japanese. They're not from Japan, or well, some of them are, but like, or some of them are Japanese, but not born, raised Japan, or yeah. It's just a term for like people inspired by J-pop idols, but performing not in Japan. <laughs> a lot of them are indie. Some of them are getting some uh, some more uh, traction. I, I, one of my favorites being uh, Galaxy Girl Paida. She's so cute. And her songs are wonderful. Uh, ah, like American <laughs> Yeah, something like that. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Welcome, welcome to my lore. But yeah, I was, I was like, this is a very appealing. I want to, I want to dance. Oh, dancing is higher than I thought. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not uploading this. No one ever, no one is ever going to see this. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> I must see you never will They're long gone Destroyed <laughs> Destroyed into itty bitty pieces No one will ever see Never even uploaded I just like I, just, I would just like look at them and go Oh You're in history <laughs> I would like Stop recording I would check back at the record and I'd go, oh, I hate this, and I'd just, I would delete it. <laughs> they didn't last for two minutes. The instant I laid my eyes upon these recordings, I deleted them. <laughs> Can be a Sabathon <laughs> milestone. <laughs> And to think you could have been a TikTok star <laughs> looking at the quality of those dances and songs. <laughs> oh, market in the late market so early. Been working here since my mom was a baby. <laughs> Just because the rhythm is slow, that don't mean that you can't blow. In the rain or in the snow. Got the gun you you can already see. <laughs> Got the, got the funky flow <laughs> All you ever need is to be nice and friendly <laughs> All you ever... Uh, <laughs> My brain is scattered Oh no, she's broken <laughs> But I was very, very much interested in like, oh, Japanese idols, overseas idols. I love this, this whole community. I will, for some reason I was in high school, I got very uh, obsessed with it and I, I, I started cataloging, cataloging every, uh, just like, hang on. In the rain or in the snow <laughs> Got the, got the funky flow In the rain or in the snow Got the, got the funky flow <laughs> Oh! 
stay fresh, stay funky. <laughs> hear ye, hear ye. I have returned from my lurk to let uh, let you all know it's sleepy, sleepy time for me. I wish you all the greatest of rest of your uh, greatest of rest of your days and or a good night. Wherever you are, however you feel, I love you for who you are. Peace out, smoochies, and stay fresh, stay funky. Oh my goodness, Lou. Thank you so much for for dropping by. I hope you'll have a wonderful sleep. S sleep well, Lou. Sleep well, Shlu. <laughs> sleep well, sweet dreams, and thank you so very, very much for stopping by. Always, always wonderful to have you here. Now put these kids to sleep, will you? Mama, 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 Shlu. <laughs> Sloop well. Sloop. Give me some food. Give me some milk. Give me some food. Give me the car. One that goes on. Now put these kids to sleep, will ya? I need a party. Oh, I'll be real naughty. Naughty, 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 naughty. Key. Somebody hold me. Somebody hug me. Oh, poor thing. Here, come with me. Mama, mama, mama. Come on, mama. Pa, 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 pa. Come on, papa. Somebody come over quick. Yeah, I'm here now. I'm gonna start a trick. Whoa, whoa. Didn't you know? I didn't know. I am a kid. You are a kid. With no control. That's okay. <laughs> but he's definitely staying funky. I, I have a problem. <laughs> I wish I'd been more talky, uh, sheepy. But my head uh, hates me today. It's doing a bad alley because a major drop in temperatures. Oh dear. But P.S. I've seen my family doc today and he did a post op check and everything's fine so far. Good, good, good. I hope it'll continue to be fine, continue to be better than ever. But sleep well, Lou. I hope you'll feel even better. Less owie when you awaken. Now can I please have my food? Of course you can, just help yourself. <laughs> Working on all the owies to un -owie. Yeah, I hope so. I hope it'll be un -owie very soon. Bye, Zs. Bye, Lou. Sleep well. Thank you so much for stopping by and don't ever apologize for, for not being so talkative. Understandable. And even if you're just like not feeling, whether it's like a physical thing keeping you, or just like, no, oh, I don't feel like it. That's perfectly fine. No worries. But yes, yeah, sleep well. See you later. Ah, you know me. <laughs> it's just Lou. Yeah, you know me. Yeah, I know you. <laughs> we'll always talk at least for a little while. Yeah, but no need to, to pressure yourself in doing so if 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 you're not feeling it. <laughs> yes, need. No. No. Set the flaps, turn the lights, fasten your seatbelts, go a flight. Uh, oh, just so many parabola songs in a row. Get in the morning, run on the track. Show me what you got, soldier. Don't you argue with me, young sheep. Why not? You know what? I won't argue with you because you gotta go to bed. Makes tiny fists. <laughs> Now's not a time for arguing. You could, we can argue when you come back. Well rested. Did I eat my drink? I thought it was pink. Fair enough, exactly. You could do battle at that time. Be sure to sleep well. The fist fight starts at noon tomorrow. <laughs> I have an appointment at noon. Okay. Are you free to fight after your appointment? To move on, it only gets much harder, so carry on. I'll send up a friend's coming over. <laughs> your friend can join your fight. The friend, your friend can join the fight. Gotta push all that to Thursday. I've got an appointment on Thursday. <laughs> Bring help, I see. My friend is too nice, so okay.
These timings are just all wrong. Soldier, get one more than the winner in the track. Show me what you got, soldier. Oh, I shall stream tomorrow because today was uh today was my two year anniversary. Oh, fun! Is this an emote where you're bonked? Bonked by scuff. I guess I could it could be multi-purpose, like one version of scuff and one version of just a bonk. Bonk on the head. But hi, Regardmore, how are you? <laughs> and have fun with your stream tom uh, tomorrow. Oh my goodness. Pillow monk. Pillow full of bricks. I almost had a heart attack. Right. Do you need an ambulance? <laughs> Just got off work. Ah, I hope you were relaxing. I expect you there, Minnie. I'll do my very best to have a look. For your anniversary, bring fists. I'll bring my hooves. Smoochies. See you later, Lou. Sleep well and have a fun, have a fun, fun time tomorrow. Hello, Lou. Temporary illusion of freedom. At least the illusion exists. At least there is an illusion. Oi, no truth, only fun. <laughs> Take over for me, please. I need to get some sleep from my head alleys. You've arrived just in time to take over Lou's uh, shift. <laughs> New. <laughs> I forgot how to pose. I don't think I ever knew how to pose. Oh, uh, I got derailed. Um, is tag team? <laughs> I haven't got my wrestler pose ready. What's your entrance theme? Like, like John Cena has. You can't see me. My, my, your, your time is up. My time is now. You can't see me. My time is now. You need. You need. You need a song regard more that'll play as you enter on stage, and take Lou's place in the tag team battle. Oh, thank you! <laughs> thank you so much for following. Welcome. Welcome to the book gathering, Aaron the Sillies. Your spelling of silly with a Z reminds me of silly bands. I don't know if that's intentional or if that's just like my brain making that connection. But hello there, Aaron, Aaron the Sillies. Thank you so much for following. <laughs> <laughs> Good question. Squints into the distance, booting up the mental jukebox. Oh, yes, indeed, it is. You are correct. Oh, it has to do with silly bands? X go and give it to you. It's kind of too popular. Yeah, you need something like with the proper amount of hype, but also not overdone. Yes. Oh dear. <laughs> Many you're psychic. I swear. <laughs> I know my stuff. I know my silly bands. Actually, I never actually. I don't think I've even even touched a silly band in my life. I've seen silly bands. I know of their existence, but I don't think I've ever actually held within my own two hooves. Or wore. Silly bands. Huh. Interesting to think about. <laughs> I like being a silly little fella. That's wonderful. Welcome, welcome to. We're all silly here. This is this is this is the place to get down, get silly. <laughs> but uh, how are you doing? Welcome, welcome. We do like being silly here. Uh, we sometimes I just can't help being silly as much as I try not to. We don't know what serious is. I don't. I don't. I don't think we do. Not at all. <laughs> what entrance songs would you assign to your different chat members, Minnie? Ah, uh, huh. 
Because <laughs> a lot of my a lot of my my discography, my my playlists are, are it's a lot of video game soundtracks and a lot of um. Oh, what a cute set of emotes that is! Oh my goodness, little rainbow cow, rainbow, cute. I'm doing great. That's good to hear. <laughs> remember the uh, remember the name by Fort Minor is too harsh. Yeah, you're right, Fort Minor. Fifty percent pain. Pass hard pass. No, <laughs> let's let's cut down the pain just a little. It doesn't have to be fifty percent. May may like twenty twenty percent of pains. That's 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 a good amount. Preferably zero preferably zero percent. But you can't go through this life with no pain whatsoever. So twenty twenty percent. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it's a lot of video game soundtracks and J-pop. Uh... How much was the pleasure ratio again? Wait... 10% luck, 20% skill, 15% concentrated power of will, 5% pleasure, 50% pain. 5% pleasure, it's five. yeah, you're right, 5% pleasure. I honestly love how everything here is so adorable. Thank you! <laughs> 100% pain, 100% more pain, 100% some more pain, 100% a little bit more pain, you know? Nothing but pain. Welcome to, to, welcome to the 2023 remix. <laughs> I gotta believe. <laughs> Mini raps, I did. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, Aaron, for... Uh... Oh, thank you! <laughs> thank you, Mr. Unpopular, for the cheer! Thank you so much! Thank you so much for the 15 star bits. That is too much pain, I see. Far too much. We gotta cut down. We gotta- we gotta ration the pain. We can't just have 50% pain all at once. Maybe like a 5% per day. Wait till she asks me for a moment. <laughs> it's inevitable. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Unpopular. <laughs> I just know she has Brava hat. Yep! It was it was activated by Miles. Miles summoned my hat. And now I must believe. <laughs> we like believing in here. Believing's a big part of what we do around these parts. We just gotta believe. <laughs> oh, uh, on the, uh, the the theme songs for chat members, uh. Ah, yes. Believe in imagination from Spongebob. Ah, yes. Imagination. Imagination. My, my next model has got to have some, like, hoof tracking capabilities so I can make gestures with my hooves to express everything I want to express that I can't express with just my face. <laughs> that'll be that'll be fun to figure out. That'll be fun to to rig up. Oh, speaking of rigs, I oh yeah, I haven't switched over to the. Wait a minute. Ah, a min shall wait. What am I waiting for? <laughs> this song sounds a bit familiar. Ah, yes, it's from uh, Mario Party 9. Oh, my gosh, I'm in year 4 from 250. That's right. That's right. 
the new tracker on VTube Studio does support hand tracking. Oh, uh, so I saw. I did see. I did check it out for a little bit. Uh, the uh, new tracking. The only problem with the new tracking, it uh, well, I, I don't have anything to uh, to you know hoof track. My model isn't capable of such a thing. But also, even if I did keep that tracking, I freaking knew it. <laughs> So close to the goal, you can make it by July, I hope so. Otherwise, the stream is done forever. No more. <laughs> the problem with the, the tracking, it's, it, it seems pretty accurate. The issue is it highlights a flaw in my model's rigging that I haven't bothered to fix. My eyes go in the opposite direction than they actually should. <laughs> with this level of rigging, I think it's like level 5, it's like not as noticeable. Like, okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna face my right and look right. I'm looking further right. I'm going to face left and look further left. Yeah, my, my eyes are wrong! <laughs> and I just haven't bothered to fix it. <laughs> but it's not too noticeable. <laughs> Unless I point it out. Otherwise, I'm gonna bust out the clipboard crap that makes the 5% decrease look like the Great Depression. <laughs> About to bust out the statistics. But yeah, when, when I make my new model, her eyes will work. Well, my eyes do work, they're just... There's, there's just that itty bitty little flaw. That little it itsy bitsy inaccuracy. <laughs> <laughs> but that'll be fixed in my my in Cinnaminis 2.0. Speaking of which, no, nah, no, nah, I'm not gonna, no, I'm not showing no previews. No. Nah. <laughs> Cinemies in your 2.0, will the emote still apply? Because, uh, it's gonna be pretty similar. Otherwise, yeah, yeah. It's pretty similar, just a, uh, an updated art style, I suppose. Well, an extra feature. It's more, mm, it's gonna have extra cost, as long as it's not too different. Not very, very different. Pretty much. Mm, it's not gonna be, like, drastically different. I when I when I first made when I first wanted to be a VTuber, I really wanted like a more. I guess because I didn't know what I was. I I, I uh, goodness. Uh, sorry, I'm I'm so uppity today. <laughs> I gotta calm down. Um, I really would have liked to have like a water like a more pastel more pastelish uh watercolor texture kind of look to me. I wanted to look more artsy, but I did, I didn't know quite how to how to pull that off with uh the way I made this model and also I didn't I don't think I would have known how to rig it if I did make it in such a way but I think now I know I have a better idea of what I'm doing so far I've only got the sketch done once the dramatic, dramatic makeover well the the main costume the main outfit rather still gonna be pajamas still gonna be pretty similar I suppose but there will be more costumes accessories all that good stuff just to see it, not to switch brands. I, I will become, I will become emo. I am going to become goth. I must reinvent myself. Oh, regarding more, more pajamas, more pajamas, nothing but pajamas. <laughs> In the archives, Minnie had a scene phase. I, <laughs> it's not just a phase, it's my life. <laughs> This is who I am. Ah, regarding my, uh, the scene stream is legendary. Regard mom, <laughs> it's not a phase. Regard mom, this is just a a, a model I'm making. Wait, oh, okay. I didn't know I I still had the mirror on that I wrote that note down. Oops, <laughs> that's gotta be erased. But yeah, I'm making a model just to test out like 
look, look at what I'm capable of, like, for a portfolio, like, look at what I'm capable of making. Wouldn't you like me to make a, make a model for you? Wouldn't that be neat? But yeah, party unicorn. I am sitting weird, and also I haven't had a lot of water to drink in a while. Okay, turn off the reflex. Uh, ah, eraser. Eraser. There we are. Impossible hair standards, I know. And I'm not sure that's exactly what I want her hair to look like. I don't know if I want it like... I guess I could have it like floaty animated... Loop animation, kind of. I'm not entirely sure what it is I want to do with her. I know I want like a bunch of accessories. A whole lot. She's gonna have like, uh... <laughs> don't tell me she's sleeping with hair that pretty. Nope, uh, well... I guess it all depends on whoever decides to portray her mohawk. <laughs> oh, I can only imagine how difficult it would be to rig up a mohawk, like, to turn with your head in live 2D. <laughs> bad head, bad head, bad head. <laughs> Specialized in sleepy characters. I think my accidental, well, not accidental. My brand. My, my characters all have to do with food. <laughs> Bounce together. <laughs> They're not all sleepy, but they do all have to do with foods. Uh, this character in particular has to do with uh, st uh, sugar star candy, con peito. Like, uh... Oh, it's not it's not shown in the mood board. Hang on, I can get another screen cap. I can get another screen cap. Yeah, she's gonna look very over the top. <laughs> Get some candy in that gourd stat. <laughs> here it is. Well, here's some of it. But yeah, these little sugar stars is what she's gonna be based off of. Why isn't there a V2 brush redeem like the V2 pet my head redeem? There should be a little brush, a little brushy brushy. Like one of those cute little doll combs. Or like, you know how like My Little Pony had had like those cute little combs, like little heart-shaped combs and stuff? Especially for like a character like I've got there. She could have a nice little comb. Uh, like Barbie brush or something. Hang on. Imagine how long it takes to dress up in all that stuff. The right one, most one is right. Yeah. <laughs> all those accessories. But that's exactly... That's exactly what I'm hoping for. <laughs> that's what... she She's going to be bombarded. She's going to be drowning in those accessories. Perfect community for V2 modeling. <laughs> Oh, that'd be so cute! Like a little comb and then it changes the hairstyle. That is cute! Dress up once and never again. Yep. Honestly, she looks so adorable. The, uh, you mean this, uh, this girl here dressed up or the, or the model? Cause, cause her, yeah. The model, thank you. <laughs> I mean, she could have a candy bracelet or a necklace. Yeah, she's gonna have a whole bunch of accessories when I'm done. I met the model. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. I hope, uh, uh I think she'll turn out cute. I, 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 I hope she'll turn out cute, and I hope someone will like her enough to want to be her, to portray her. Portray her. When she is done. I could not wear that many little things. Yeah, same here, honestly. Like, it looks so cute. But if I had to, like, be aware of all that stuff on my being. Like, I'm wearing all this, all these things. Yeah. <laughs> looks, uh, Sailor Moon-esque. I suppose that, oh yeah, I guess I did kind of make a Sailor collar, didn't I? <laughs> in, in, uh. Because <laughs> I know we need to get in high gear. Come on, hurry. I need you to hurry. I thought you were in a hurry. But don't worry. Come on, hurry. I need you to hurry. I thought you were in a hurry. But don't worry. No need to worry, because I know the deal. The trees will grow back for sure. That's for real. 
Ain't this fun? Having fun in the sun? I love chopping down trees just for fun. Ain't this fun? Having fun in the sun? I love rocking to the beat just for fun. Don't forget, uh, I mean for real, my teen saws rule with the world with the peel. Don't forget, uh, I mean for real, my teen saws rule with the world with the peel. Never use Joe's tin saints for them. Rock to the beat, rolling with the heat. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Rolling up high in the sun, chopping down trees just for fun. Roll it to the side, turn it up high, turn it up high, turn it down side, do, 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 do. roll it to the side. We're gonna make a good guitar with this wood. So give it all you got, girl. I mean, for real. A unicorn model is just, uh, it's just added a sprinkle of glitter, cuteness, rainbow, pastel, and poof, a chef's kiss. <laughs> Three simple ingredients to make the perfect little unicorn. Well, actually, fake corn. Because her, her horn's gonna be, it's gonna be a, a fraud. It's just a party hat that she says is a horn. <laughs> She's really just a pony. Don't forget, uh, I mean for real. My train saws rule with the world with the peel. Don't forget, uh, I mean for real. My train saws rule with the world with the peel. Never use Justin's chains for them. No, it's a lie. Yeah. <laughs> it's a sneaky, sneaky lie. It's just a cute little party hat. She, she's pretending to use her horn. And like, I'm going to make it to where you can... It should be tilted then. Actually, I'm gonna have it to where you can somewhat, somewhat see the headband deceiver. <laughs> You'll be able to see the headband that holds on the, the hat. Perhaps is the name. Through her bangs. It'll be like, depending on how she turns her head, you'll be able to see the horn slightly. <laughs> Oh, yeah, when I bump into tables and open doors and get all fussy at how far apart my fingers have, my fingers have to stay. <laughs> Power puppy coin. It's all a lie. Man, we've been lied to, <laughs> we've been lied to this whole time. Fraudulence. I want my money back. Oh, but yeah, these little brushes. This would be so cute. Like, someone redeems the, the uh, brush the pony. Or brush the, brush the pretty unicorn. And this little brush shows up on screen. Pick up. And then her hairstyle changes. That'd be pretty cute. Pick up. And they call Satan the Prince of Lies. <laughs> Isn't that from Barbie MLP Toys? One of those. I, I just looked up Barbie brush and this is one of the results. But yeah, something like that. It, it could be from either. The unicorn horn is the tiara among equines. One well, of the hairstyles should be bald. <laughs> she has... <laughs> I don't want to let her be caught bald. But that, I suppose that could be also a redeem. <laughs> do, 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 do. Don't get caught bald. But then I wonder if she was bald, what would I do with the... That would expose her horn. That her horn's a fraud. We don't let friends get caught bald around here. Not in these areas. No. Don't get caught bald. Friends don't let friends get caught bald. Oh, sorry. I think I bumped my mic with my cup of water. Sorry. <laughs> Fun fact. I remember, I remember I have a Barbie doll for some reason. And I brushed her hair so hard the hair got loose. I used to cut the Barbie. I, I really expected the hair to grow back when I would cut the cut off the hair of, off a Barbie doll and I was so I was so saddened when it wouldn't grow back I was very confused no one teaches you to brush hair from end to root not root to end I yeah I guess that's also a problem like you're just pulling it straight from the roots I remember I cut Barbie hair too <laughs> I really thought it would grow back She looks so ugly after I cut her hair. <laughs> I, I, I can't remember exactly how bad it looked, but it probably did look pretty bad when I did it. But I really thought it would grow back. I was so disappointed it didn't grow back. <laughs> I was so mad. I'm not quite sure what I want to do with this outfit. 
I think I want to be like kind of like a puppy tutu skirt. Hmm. But I'm not sure exactly. I want this little um shooting star like tie thing. And then the uh, the it has like these colors. I don't know. I remember looking at my Barbie's, uh, my friend's Barbie in horror. Hair growth is hardly noticeable in my family, so it was not even an assumption that it had grown back. <laughs> you knew better. I think I remember a commercial of magical grow hair Barbie toy. I think I remember something like that too, like a toy that just like the the hair just you could make it grow. I think I remember something like that too. There should be a support group for Barbie dolls that have been mangled by little children. Maybe that's, I, I haven't seen the... I've only ever seen Toy Story 1 and 2. Wait, what was Toy Story 2? Toy Story 1 I remember pretty vividly. But what was, Toy, what was the story of Toy Story 2? Oh, that's the one with... Wait. That's the one with the Toy Store? Yeah. But I've never, I've never seen 3 and 4. But a support group for Barbies that have been mangled by by their own, by their owners sounds like a, like a gag that would have been in a Toy Story movie. I remember more clay hair dolls. Uh, I remember... I, I enjoy hearing former kids recall the kinds of soap operas they put their Barbies through. I used to, I used to do that with Lilith's Pet Shop. I had Littlest Pet Shop, that's right! I had a couple of these little list, Littlest Pet Shop uh, pets. And they would go through some drama. <laughs> I can't remember what exactly. But they went through some stress. When he gets sold to a collector. Oh yes, okay, that was the second one. The, the collector, the toy barn. I remember, I remember. But three and four, I don't know anything about. Okay, so never mind. Oh, never mind. There are no such thing as magical grow hair toys. I could have sworn I saw something like that, like a like a Barbie doll that grew her hair longer. Did we both just hallucinate that? <laughs> doll grow hair. Sends Brittany down the staircase. <laughs> Throw the dog down the stairs. <laughs> They're like uh, cut and stick hair toys, if I can remember. Use a backup reserve, not forever. Yeah, I, uh, I know. I, I, I was sure that hair doesn't last forever, but I remember like a uh, a doll that you can like change the hair length of, and it would like. I don't know. I kind of sworn I saw co some commercial for a Barbie doll that, like, you do some kind of mechanism and then her, her hair grows longer than it would have been if you didn't do that. <laughs> I think so, like, bro, I remember so well there's a Barbie commercial for I, I, I could have sworn there was! <laughs> This is a Mandela effect going on here. It must be. <laughs> Okay, uh... <laughs> Did any of you have any experience with sea monkeys? Dolly Surprise? Oh, I can't find the commercial like that. Impossible. Dolly Surprise. D 
Surprise growing hair doll. Maybe? 1987. This is more recent. No, not recent. Uh, I could have sworn I, I remember like seeing commercials on TV. For... Weird. Oh, I think I might have uh, found it uh, a bit. Is it fine if I send the Barbie commercial in here? Oh, yes, just a moment. Let me pr give you the permission to do so. Uh, permit Aaron the silliness. Okay, so now you can post the link without worry of being banned. <laughs> da, 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 da. Oh, nope. Oh, wait. Yep, yep, yep. What a strange looking doll. <laughs> oh, okay. Here's the YouTube video. Totally here, Barbie. Oh, of course, I get a Barbie commercial first. <laughs> Or Barbie the movie, movie Barbie commercial for bar Barbie movie commercial. Totally here, Barbie. Oh my goodness, the styling. That is very... Of its time. <laughs> Very stylish and beautiful, I know. It's so 90s. Well, 80s, route 1992. Yep, yeah, this would have been... This is still 80s style, isn't it? All the crimps in her hair. And... Whatever they did to her bangs. I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> what an era that was. Totally here, Barbie. Hmm. Honestly, back in my times, we said, I want it. No, fair, fair. Like, I'm not saying it looks bad. I'm just saying, like, it's so very 80s. <laughs> Which isn't a bad thing. It's just, it's right in your face. This is the 80s, baby. <laughs> Eighties in its purest form. Oh, we're we're still looking at this doll. Hang on, <laughs> get rid of that. <laughs> mm, I'm gonna start over with her outfit. Well, okay, the the hair accessories I'm fine with, but this. I'm not sure what I what kind of outfit. Whoop, oh, wrong. Does anybody remember a chocolate fountain toy commercial from Japan called Sugar Bunnies? Some sort like that? Chocolate fountain toy. Sugar Bunnies. I am not familiar with this, I think. I know Sugar Bunnies is like a, uh, I think Sanrio character? Called Sugar Bunnies? But a chocolate fountain. Here, let me see. Oh wait, I had to. I had to give you permission again. One second. Oh, okay. Okay, it's okay. Oh right, YouTube links are allowed. Right. <laughs> oh yeah, it is sugar bunnies. Okay, that's the sugar bunnies I was thinking of. But I never saw this commercial, but it looks so cute. I 
I know, right? It really does. It's from Japan. I've been trying to have it one day. It looks super, super cute. One day I'll get it. One of these days. One of these days, my dream will come true, and I shall have that chocolate fountain. Sugar bunnies. Do, 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 do. But yeah, Sanrio has so, so much cute stuff. Too much cute stuff. Someday my sweets will come. <laughs> It's so rare to see the senior character have merchandise. I have, uh... I've heard of the Sugar Bunnies. I, I, I haven't really checked out much of their... I don't really see much of their merch at all. Like, if I were to go on the Sanrio website, which I do occasionally go sometimes, I've never bought anything from the Sanrio site. But one of these days, I want to. <laughs> they have so much cute stuff. But yeah, I suppose I haven't really seen much of the Sugar Bunnies on there. At all. Oh, if you search for it, then there's some. $30 tote bag. Ow. <laughs> yeah, not very much at all. May it's more popular in Japan. May, may if you, uh, we discussed this earlier about, uh, shopping through ja Japanese au auction sites. Maybe there's more stuff available through there than it would be in, in uh, American stores. There's also a sugar bunny ice cream maker. Oh dear, that's also very, very cute. There's also so much underrated senior characters. Wait, what? Yes, look at it, look at it. Ice cream maker! <laughs> Sugar Bunny show is so cute, for real. I didn't even realize they had a show. I know there's the Hello Kitty show, and there's My Melody. I need to watch the Sanrio shows. <clears throat> well, I could go counts too, I suppose. That one I've watched some of. <laughs> there's a Sugar Bunny's ice cream maker. OMG, I know! Look at it! So cute! I was about to get out of my chair, and then Archie started asking for cuddles. Sun trapped, and you can never leave. This is your fate, Neil. I hope you enjoy. <laughs> uh, I would, st I would steal it. So, uh, I would steal it so much I stole every sugar money merchandise. <laughs> Oh, there's a DS game of Sugar Bunnies. Sugar Bunnies, Yume no Sweet Skobo. I imagine it's probably not... It's no, never been translated to English. What? Yep, there's a, a game on Nintendo DS of Sugar Bunnies. Wait, Yume no Sweet... Okay, yeah. Sugar Bunnies Dream Sweet Studio? Seems to be the English title? Well... Uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> How I didn't know there's a Sugar Bunnies game? It might just only be in Japanese. Uh, Sugar Bunnies... Yume... No... Sweets. Yume no Sweets Global. Uh...
Oh, honestly, I think it's just because he's got an itch on the side where his leg's missing. Where, where the leg's missing, he's trying to be cute about it. Oh my goodness. This is your job. Fix it. OMG, fun fact. This looks cute. This is Sugar Bunny's Air Chocolate Maker Mix. Air Chocolate? Is that like chocolate that's like light and airy, I suppose? Ah, pardon me, Yanni. Yeah, go search it. We'll do. Sugar Bunny's Ear Chocolate. Oh, the, the make... The, they're so cute! The little devices with which you make these things are so cute! It's like a little ice... Look at this! Oh my goodness. There's... It's all too cute. I know, right? Oop. But that is so cute. Choco Choco Pukurin. Choco Choco Pukurin. There are far too many cute things here. There's so much sugar, sugar Buddies merchandise to buy and steal. One or the other, <laughs> I would assume. Well... Both? You buy it, then you steal it? You steal it, then you buy it? If you steal, buying is redundant. If you buy, stealing is redundant. Yes. <laughs> Uh, there's also a gummy maker and ice cream roll of sugar. Oh my goodness. Far too many cute things and all things I would be very much interested in, but. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> More merchandise to dream of. Gummies and fruity yogurt go together. I've never tried that combination, but I see it. I see it. I taste it. In my imagination. On my imagination tongue. I can I can imagine that. Oh, on the topic of obscure senior characters, Madame Fubiori is so very precious to me. <laughs> I wish I had some merch of Madame Fubiori. I he is so underrated. Little mopu. <laughs> My brain is saying yum. Yeah, that's 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 a good way of putting it. My brain is saying yum. That's that's a better way of putting it. Look, like, look. This is all they got in the shop for Marumofobiori on Sanrio.com. This is all they have. One shirt. That's all they got of my boy Mapu. I need more. <laughs> Thumbs down. <laughs> Mind if I send a link of the Sugar Bunny's ice cream roller? Oh, one sec. Let me make sure you're permitted to do so. Permit. Here in the sleeves. Okay. Just one shirt. That's sad, man. I know. Mop was too cute to just have one shirt. <laughs> At least Gudetama is popular. One shirt. That is so sad. 
And he's he's so precious. He deserves more love. May he's not popular with the with the, with outside of Japan or something. Doll. <laughs> he's so relatable. He's just sleepy. We demand a plushie. There probably exists a plushie, but me, it's a. Uh... Oh, hi there. Oh, hi, <laughs> big. <laughs> It's me, man who studies languages. I return with some good and bad news. Which do you want first? Ah, uh, whichever you su I suppose whichever you feel is the best to share with us. But hi, Bread Bun Bun. I hope you're doing well despite the bad news. Is Sugar Bunny a lot though? Uh, oh, Sugar Bunny on the Sanrio website? Uh, there's a few things. I have enlarged. Do any of you have a care about Star Trek? I know nothing about Star Trek, sorry. Oh, well, your Klingon. How, how's your Klingon going? How's your Klingon going? Not really. No, not really. <laughs> oh, dear. It's not that I don't care. It's just that I... That I... I'm not familiar with Star Trek, you know? Okay, cool. So, bad news first. This ice cream maker is so cute. It's all so cute. It's all too much. I hope bad news isn't too bad. Even if I'm not a Star Trek fan. Death by cuteness. It's all too much. Death by cuteness and sweetness. With all this, all this sugar you're going to be eating. With the sugar bunnies, ice cream makers, chocolate makers... Ice cream makers, chocolate makers. <laughs> it's all it's all it's all too much. Oh, so Mr. Gardner's allergic to rabbits. Oh no. Sugar bunnies are my favorite scenario. Mine's a, a t uh uh, I'd say mine's a tie between Mar Marumufubiori, Agresco, and Gurutama. Yeah. There, there's so many cute ones, though. Uh, I'm taking an indefinite break from studying uh, Cherokee. Uh, I can't remember the, the terminology, the proper terminology, but uh, Cherokee, due to shaky circumstances at my home, making studying it unviable. And I'll focus my studies back on the Klingon. Oh, dear. I hope those circumstances will... Get out of your way soon so you can get back to studying and having, uh, studying the languages you want to study. But good luck with your Klingon! Is there more good news? Yeah, uh, if that's the bad news, I hope you'll be able to get back into studying that soon. And I hope, you have a, uh, hope you'll enjoy your Klingon in the meantime. So, uh, what's... The good news, I suppose. Hiccup. <laughs> this is what Sanrio has available of sugar bunnies on their website. Not very much, but it's not just a shirt. Oh yeah, do you know they also have Gurutama Cafe? The cafes, I need- One of these days I want to go to one of those cafes, whether it's the Gurutama Cafe, especially the Kirby Cafe. Oh my goodness, the Kirby Cafe looks absolutely precious. Oh, and rabbits are easy to draw cute, so he's at a real risk of dying from cuteness. Oh. His heart and his sinuses can't take it. Gurutama Bum Oh, Bum Bum Pudding! Of course, Bump Bump Pudding is adorable, too. Okay, uh, all this... So much cute merchandise. Now to work on something that'll help me towards my goal of obtaining cute merchandise. Okay, let me redesign her outfit here. Because I'm not totally sure what it is I want. Oh, pardon, pardon the nudity! Oh dear, nudity! Also, I didn't finish her hooves. <laughs> 
She's indecent. Hang on. Eh. Degenerate. <laughs> She's nude. Hang on. Okay, you know, that's close. That's that's close. Yep, that's close. She's wearing a a, a one piece suit now. Oh God, she's naked. <laughs> Not anymore. She's now wearing a one piece suit fit for the beach. She is going on summer vacation. She's no longer violating Twitch terms of service. Please don't report me. <laughs> Oh, uh, <clears throat> my voice is dying on me, oh my goodness. <laughs> In good news, however, Star Trek recently got some huge news relating to Klingons. They finally returned to their classic looks after being indeterminately stuck on a controversial, controversial look for a long time. And also, in this new episode, Mark Okrand, creator of the Klingon language, was listed, as a, was listed as a language consultant, and a new dialect was revealed, meaning there might be a big new Klingon language stuff very soon. That's real nice! That'll be interesting! That'll be fun! I hope you have fun with this new dialect! All this in-depth... The language goes so in-depth, interesting! <laughs> like a Barbie! I never liked the mandatory undies on the Barbie! <laughs> Oh, there's already dialects? I personally can only speak two dialects of Klingon at the moment. How how many are there total? I didn't know there was even any dialect. I thought it was just the one the one and only Klingon language. But there's dialects to it too. I think five. This is Huh. Interesting. Posh and poor. <laughs> uh, no, not naked. No naked. Oh yeah, does anyone remember in 2016, there was this uh, popular spicy ramen challenge trend? I think I recall something like that. I never took part, but there is always a trend somewhere out there in the world. I remember the cinnamon challenge. Oh, Klingons have no such class systems. It's all based on region. There is so much more to this than I thought. Swamp and hill. <laughs> uh, let me pull up some outfit reference. Oh, I got my my southern Klingon dialect. Howdy doody, y'all. <laughs> I want her to have like a puffy tutu kind of skirt. Hmm. I remember my sister and my third sister were doing that and I was like, ooh, yummy ramen. And a minute later, my stomach hurts. <laughs> oh, hi. Remember that you have ears, chat. Hi, Geldy! How are you? How are you doing? And thank you so much for the cheer! How's it going? Remember, we have ears. What shall we do with our ears? Hi, hi! How are you? <laughs> Got a lurk. Oh, okay, enjoy your lurk! Erin has to go make some progress. Hop to it! <laughs> Just remember that you have them. Be aware! Be aware. Now that you are aware, you're prepared. <laughs> that all make no sense. Oh, hang on. Uh, but yeah, that's the problem with spicy foods. Even if I could tolerate like the spiciness ingesting it, the problem is in your stomach later. Ma 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 ma. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Give me some milk. Give me some food. Give me the car. When that goes boom. The car's playing horse sound. <laughs> what to do? Need to go, you know. 
Somebody come here quick. I'm gonna start a trick. Here I go. Didn't you know? I am a kid. With no control. <laughs> so most dialects only have regional variations in words. But things like the Morskin dialect even have sound and mild grammar differences. It's so very in-depth. Are you the person who's named for Rappa Rappa? Are you the person who's named for Rappa Rappa? Oh, was it Mama? Mama, Mama, Mama. Oh, was it Mama? Mama, Mama, Mama. Uh, but yeah, that's actually the dialect I speak, by the way. Hey, hey, Papa, don't you think I'm good? Now, can I please have my food? What are we drawing today? Oh, yes, uh, I'm switching between drawing emotes and drawing this, uh, Trying to make a new VTuber, not, not for myself, but just a VTuber model to show off like, Hey, this is what I'm capable of, of making, drawing, and rigging up. A model! Haha! -ha. <laughs> Need to go to bed for real, Mama. But buy the toy for me before, Papa. Buy the toy for me before, Papa. Oh, cool. Thank you. Okay, let me, uh, sorry. So catch up to chat. Uh, gonna go sleep now. Have a good stream. Hope you come back, uh, to your stream also. See you later, Aaron. Thank you so much for hanging out. And I hope you enjoy. Have a nice sleep. Sleep well. Sweet dreams to you. Thank you so much for hanging out today. <clears throat> Hello, gal. I like spicy, but not if it's too spicy. But I can also not explain what's too spicy for you. Yeah, same here! Like, okay, if it's like a very mild, mild, mild spicy, then like, okay, this is fine. But I can't quite discern what my tolerance is for spicy. I'm interested just to see if I- um, I'm interested just to see if I can perceive the differences. Yeah, uh, you can go ahead and show us an example of the dialect differences, because... I want to know just how- how far it goes in here. <coughs> Good night. You're cute. I try to be cool like uh, Lou and say hello, like a, like a good surreal meme. But oftentimes I misspell. Hell no. <laughs> For all we know, you eat magma, but your tolerance is so high and you're just humble. <laughs> you never know. But nah, I, I can't tolerate even the slight. Well, an itsy bitsy itsy bits of, of, of spiciness. Is maybe okay. Sometimes. If I'm in the mood for it. Oh goodness, I can't even begin to pronounce whatever this is. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know the, the pronunciation uh, standards. Is it in standard Klingon? But in Morse code dialect, it would be... Okay, let me have a... Uh... I don't think I could say it without choking! <laughs> you didn't grow up on smoldering charcoal, can you, Margaritas? Okay, uh... Look, huh? I see some slight differences, but I can't even begin to pronounce these. I, w I wonder if there's a like some like there's text to speech. I wonder if there's text to speech for Klingon. Actually, if I do text to speech with this, can I interpret it? There kind of is. I'm gonna see if this one can handle it. Uh, choo -choo 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 -choo. Oh, there it is. Blink. Cinnamonies says B I had a got a comma. Da. V I would slain higher. Did that sound about right for you? Was that was that accurate? <laughs> I 
My phone tends to autocorrect and load to help. I can't tell you how often many people <laughs> how often people in Twitch chat ask me what they should help me with. <laughs> help. <laughs> uh, what, what, what do you need help with, buddy? <laughs> Don't bother trying to pronounce it. There are many non-English sounds. I, I would, I would imagine so. That was a very treat. Don't shame me. See, cool kid privilege. Hashtag normalize henlo typos. It's really interesting that they didn't just make a different language, but also dialects. That's especially, like, yeah. I, I didn't even begin to think there was dialects to this, like, fictional language. There has to be. Nerds make text-to-speech and Klingon is max nerd. <laughs> It's very, 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 very rough, but I could get you one that does it properly. Unfortunately, regular TS uh, text-to-speech but butchers Klingon worse than people do. Let me get the primitive Klingon text-to-speech. Okay, let me know when you when you have a hold of it. If you're gonna link it, let me know before you do, so that I can uh, uh, permit you to link things in chat. <laughs> Conling is what we, er, they call it. Those nerds. Constructed language. Oh, okay, I've heard of conling before, but I didn't know. I didn't realize that was what it was short for. Constructed language, or so I heard. Just you know, just a rumor. <laughs> but I have heard of that before. Okay, I have it. If you put a uh, standard Klingon text in here, you'll get a very choppy text speech doing the pronunciation of single sentences. Okay, one sec for permission. Bread bun bun. Bowl of soup. I love soup. And Toroku. Okay. And I wonder how to pronounce, like, English. Oh, use that only. <laughs> do -do -do -do. Enter a word or sentence that you would like to hear spoken and click the generate buttons. Please note that while the system pronounces syllables correctly, it does not apply correct stress to words, and the timing of the sentence may not be correct. Good pronunciation will require time with experienced speakers. Huh. This reminds me of a visual novel where the MC gets warped into an alternate Earth where everyone speaks Esperanto, and you actually have to learn it to understand what's happening. Oh, right! You, uh, I believe you talked about it before. I can't remember the title, but you did bring it up before. Of where you had to, like, actually... Learn the language to get through the game. Soup, soup. Ah, pardon my yawning. Making a text to speech for Klingon is max. That's maximum Star Wars fan. Oh, hang on. Let me mute my music real quick, so we can have. A uh, hear of the Klingon text to speech if I copy and paste Brad Bun's example. Hold on. Oh, let me get a sample. Okay. Here, I got a little sample. Here, I don't have a sample. Because ample times is what we don't have. Because money and times is what we don't have. I need to be a uh, proper Klingon, you guys can discern. Okay, proper Klingon. Proper grammar. Proper grandma. Ahem. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, let me sh uh, choo -choo -choo -choo. I do like, you better learn to communicate with these people games. <laughs> I don't like Esperanto. Ah, this is on the Klingon Assault Group's Klingon Academy, which is an amazing resource for Klingon learners. Okay, the expression- oh, the expression Amrilato. Yuri Visual Novel. Okay, I- I could have sworn I have that bookmark somewhere. 
Oh, yep, I do. I just couldn't remember the title. <laughs> it's on my wish list, too. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, proper Klingon. Let's have a listen. I hope the volume isn't going to be, like, unholy. Okay, I can adjust it. All is well with the world. Oh! <laughs> the noise jump scared me! I don't know if you can all hear the same volume I did, but it's just like... <laughs> it's very cursed. Okay. <laughs> Did the guy have a lump you needed out of his throat or something? <laughs> oh, let's have another listen to that. With Okay. Now I know. Very quiet on our end. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to try not to get jump scared. Okay. Let me put it. Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my desktop audio. Okay, let me have one more. Because I, I, I have the button. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, <laughs> the learning curve just to reproduce this. <laughs> You're so right. That sentence also demonstrates one interesting note about Klingon uh, uh, phonotactics. I don't even know what I, I was. I thought you were going to say phonetics, but. Bono tactics? I don't think I've ever heard of that in my life. The study of the rules governing the possible ph ph uh, phenome senses in a language. Huh. Phono tactics. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> Phono tactics, the study of the rules governing the possible phenom or phonom phoneme phenom sequences in the language. What does this word pronounce? How like phoneme? Phoneme, phoneme, phoneme. Sorry. <laughs> uh, phoneme is a unit of sound in language. I am not familiar with that term at all. Never heard of it before. I can imagine lots of choking and coughing. <laughs> in Klingon, the way uh oh, the way vowels are constructed in Klingon is usually always consonant syllable consonant or consonant vowel. <laughs> Margaritas, be respectful. Someone currently alive has an endangered language that sounds just like this. And they're probably feeling sick today. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. I am not familiar with this with phono tactics. This is all brand new information to me. Syllables are usually like cat or bat or ma or pa, never like packed or train. However, there are two exceptions to this rule. Okay, what, one more, one more for you all. Yeah. <laughs> Goodness. One is the syllable ending r, which is two consonants. In imported words and names. Oh yeah, I wonder how you'd say someone's name. Hang on. Hmm. 
Give me a name, I'll transliterate. Uh, I suppose my own name, Cinnamini, or I guess just Mini, just Mini. It said the exact same. Oh, okay. I suppose so. I always was puzzled that Spanish fluently borrowed English words. <laughs> oh. Uh, generate the audio. It doesn't seem to want to. But okay, it would be pronounced the same anyway. So you would fit in. So you would fit in so well in Klingon society, Mini. They could say my name. That's all they need. What are some, like, English... Well, borrowed English words are so interesting in other languages. Like, yep. Let's just... Take a little bit of that. Press X to down. <laughs> and your craving for violence is at least equal. At least? We're on the same level here? Uh, and if you did your full name, it becomes a slight bit more interesting becoming... I suppose that would be pronounced Sinni Minni? Possibly much higher. Which is said Shinni Minni. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, what about Cinnamon Swirl? They do not have Z or, or S sounds, only sh... Oh, okay. She ni me ni She ni me ni Mini is an alt so nuts kidding She ni me ni She ni me ni Sinly Mini is just mini after dark and that's why I always end the stream before dinner <laughs> We never get no Stinley Mini. Shinny Mini, the Klingon alternate reality version, so you can go commit sin. <laughs> Sounds like cereal, Sinny Minis. Technically, there is a cereal called Sinny, uh, well, Cinnaminis. There is a cereal like that. Yep, somewhere in Europe. There does exist Cineminis, Cineminis cereal. Would they say Pisha or for pizza? Pisha. Whoa. <laughs> Cineminis cereal. Or Cineminis. Actually, yes. In Europe, Cinnamon Toast Crunch is called Cine Minis. Oh, okay, yep. Cine, uh, cinnamon Toast Crunch. Cine Minis. That's me. Sponsor me. Sponsorship offer Cinnamon... Exactly! Cine Minis! <laughs> I can change my name to fit the brand. I can do that. In Klingon, the way to say pizza is... Pizza chat, which is a transliteration of pizza and then the word pie. Ah. To be fair, Cinnamon Toast Crunch is a mouthful. Yeah, but it's not as catchy, is it? Cinnamon Toast Crunch. It's not as cat. It's a good cereal, but that, that particular title isn't very catchy. Like, Cinny Minis, that's cute. But why pie? When, because when the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's amore. When the moon hits your eye, like a big pizza. Oh damn, you're right. <laughs> Let's see. There's a reason. There's hardly enough pink in their brand. I, I, I can inject the pink you need into your brand, Nestle. Nestle? Nestle? I don't know how you pronounce. Sorry. <laughs> I'll learn. If you sponsor me, I'll learn. Also, in this alternate reality where you're Klingon, you're actually not a sheep. You're a... 
Oh, I don't know how that would pronounce. Uh, is a clean animal that's similar to an earth sheep. Oh, okay. So if I ever have a Star a Star Trek theme, I was about to say Star Wars. If I ever have a Star Trek theme, I'll know. I will become Durak. However, that's pronounced. I'll learn the pronunciation first. Pronunciation of pizza. Pit sha chab. Pizza pizza chab. Pit sha chab. Pizza chab. Pit sha chab. Pizza chab. I can't. I can't do it. <laughs> they could make the mascots cuter though. Yeah, they could. Well, they're pretty cute. They're pretty cartoon- like, they have the charm that the anthropomorphic Happy Meals don't have. They got the shine in their eyes, they got big cartoony mouths, they're pretty cute. They're not scary like the- the- true. <laughs> and this is- Dirac. Dirac. Hello again. Hi Savannah, welcome back to the derailment of my stream. Dirac. Dirac. How's it going? It said, oh, birak. Oh, birak. Dirak. Dirak. Birak. No, no? Oh? The happy new mascot is kind of scary, yeah. <laughs> oh, there's a pause in it. Okay. Hang on. Let me get that one more time. Dirak. Dirak. Good, got some first stage approvals. Oh! Approvals! That sounds good. I don't really know it for- I, I suppose this means like, approved for something in your- in your business, in your- in your animation goings-ons. But, good! Good to hear! How goes your art? It's not going. <laughs> We're learning Klingon! <laughs> We're learning Klingon! <laughs> Red Bun Bun is teaching us Klingon. <laughs> Did you know there are different dialects of Klingon? Perhaps five of them? Ah, when an eel has a maw with a... I don't know how to pronounce that word, jaw, that's sabore. <laughs> when the jaws open wide and there's more jaws inside, that's amore. <laughs> When it sulks in a reef, it has two sets of teeth, that's amore. When an eel bites your thigh and you bleed out and die, that's amore. <laughs> okay, uh, still catching up to chat. Um... Were you there when Minnie courageously fixed the Happy Meal mascot? I I might still have that file somewhere on my on my desktop. I wasn't. I wasn't. <laughs> Klingon is very tough to pronounce. Lots of funky things. There sure are. So very many. So many rules. Uh, let me count the known dialects. Six known dialects, only five of which have any known uh, of which having any exploration. Oh, okay. How do you say, I'd like a diet soda, please, in Klingon? <laughs> ah, so I do my art, and my supervisor looks at it, and it uh, it gets initially approved by them, and then gets passed to be reviewed by the show supervisor when they approve it. Then it's creatively approached and in the show. Uh, or approved uh, and in the show. Then I tech check it again. Uh, then I tech check it. And it gets reviewed again by all the heads of the department for final approval. Oh, that sounds like a painful process. <laughs> There's a lot of steps here, but so far, so good. Am I allowed to ask? Well, this sounds like top secret information you've got here. I don't, I don't think you can go with that in depth, I think. <laughs> but interesting. I hope it'll continue. I hope the approvals will continue to roll. Oh, that, uh, depends on how one wishes to translate diet soda. I see, I see. Intric this It's very intricate, the way you can go about this. 
Uh, oh, the McDonald the mascots, the McDonald's, my, my revision. I've got, I've, I've got it somewhere, I think. Uh, when the moon hits your eye, like a big pizza pie. I've got it somewhere, don't I? The Happy Meal Surgery. Where's my Happy Meal Surgery? On my desktop? Uh... Oh, I need- I, the music! Sorry, the music's been, uh... <laughs> Sorry! <clears throat> the good thing is when I showed my pass, my supervisor had no notes, so it's a very good sign I'll be approved creatively tomorrow. Nice! Oh, do you also fix other mascots? Because I have issues with the Pringles Man, Hello Kitty, and Jelly Bee too! They're eyes! <laughs> <laughs> None of those are as nightmarish as the happy ones. Not no no nowhere near as much. Uh May I actually deleted it at some point? Wait! Here it is! <laughs> oh, wait, this is this is them. This is them in their natural state before. This is how they look. All nat, all all natural. Goodness, my voice is drying. My 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 throat I need water. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hello there! Thank you so much for following. Oh! Oh, cow moji censoring, what's going on there? But thank you so much for following! Welcome to the Wool Gathering! Thank you so much for, <laughs> for joining us for this! <laughs> Gato de Minas? Let me know if I'm saying your name right. Oh, well, if you, if you, if you want me to, uh... <laughs> Kill that box! <laughs> Kill that damn box! Wait, I could, I fixed them! <laughs> I forgot! <laughs> Don't they look so much better? <laughs> oh, thank you so much for following, uh, Gato de Minas. Um, welcome to the whole gathering. <laughs> welcome for jo better now. I know, right? Is that the Herald? Yeah, that's Herald. <laughs> that is Herald. Oh, hang on, uh... Leaves a voicemail for the patient to come in for a checkup. <laughs> Is that the periodic table behind them? It's... I, 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 I truly wish I knew. <laughs> uh, for more fun, I usually have four review process and three supervisors. Four pro... Oh, goodness. That's a lot. Oh, and thank you, regard more for the take care redeem. I shall take care. I shall sit up proper. I shall have a sip of water. Thank you very much. Hello, Kato de, uh, Kato de Minas. Welcome. Better now. <laughs> this is what I need before graduation nightmare. <laughs> Why can I recognize this man? I've been on the internet for two. <laughs> oh, so um, my best translation was, uh, we'll have a pronunciation of that in a second, which is I want healthy bub, uh, healthy juice which bubbles. Klingons don't say please. Ah. <laughs> Oh, speaking of, I gotta go snooze so I can wake up early. Go do that, Margarita. Sleep well. 
Have fun tomorrow to graduation. Congratulations, congratulations. Sleep well, sweet dreams. Have fun tomorrow. Have a good night. Yep, yep, have a good night. Sleep well. See you later, Margaritas. And, uh, if, before you go, if you want to learn the Klingon, I want, I want the healthy juice bubbles. <laughs> Take that with you. Impress your friends. You can't let them graduate without them knowing this vital information. Feel your vitality coursing through you, Margaritas. DJ Vol Oh, right, you're right. There, it's like DJ volume levels, like like the visual uh, audio visualizer, because they're dancing in the art in the commercial. Ooh, thank you. But you see the shine in their eyes. Oh, uh, are you from Southeast Asia? What is this? Let me have a translation of that, because I don't know what language this even is. Uh, odd thing to say, but, um, Lao, or Laotian, uh, Laotian, or Lao? Oh, uh, that's one of a number of possible translations, however, don't take it as gospel. There are far, far better Klingon, uh, uh, Klingon, uh, Klingon is the me. That's hard for me to say. Klingon is. <laughs> I'm from Latin America. Oh, okay. Congrats again, Mar. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'll say that when I'm ordering drinks. <laughs> and they'll understand you perfect. They'll be impressed. They'll be still very impressed with you. And I don't speak Spanish. Okay, uh, let me know if I'm pronouncing your name correctly, then. Because uh, me, it's not, uh, it wouldn't be pronounced, uh, because I'm saying it gato, like a cat in Spanish. Gato de minas, but uh, I'm not exactly sure. Portuguese? Uh, I see, I see. I thought because of the, I think, Thai. Uh, according to Google Translate, it's Laotian. Cat from mines. Oh, okay, gato de, uh... The Minas. Gato. Gatito. <laughs> I can't differentiate between Thai and Laotian. Can you discern between Latin and Cherokee? <laughs> Finger gun and mouth clicks and approval. I can't, I can't do the... I can't. <laughs> Hoof guns. Ah, I have so many tabs open. Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Oh, music, return. Okay, that's enough of this Mc McNightmare and the cinnamon -y cereal. And, okay, <laughs> back to, back to, what time is it? 7.13. <laughs> I'll keep streaming till, uh, 7, 7... 45, 7.45, that's a good time, why not? <laughs> oh, I'm from Southeast Asia. I can differentiate between, uh, Hanuno? Baibain? I don't know how these, any of these are pronounced, sorry. I've never heard of any of them. Uh, well, Havanese I've heard of, I think. Uh, Nushu? In other Asian scripts, I learned Japanese, Korean, and Chinese in school. So many! I We barely even learned one language. Well, English, and then and you could choose to... Well, actually, it was required to learn some other language, but you only got the one. Whether that was Spanish or French, or... I think there was a German class? I think. The Wool Gathering is international and intergalactic with Klingon. <laughs> But I never learned the uh, Indic script from the Southeast Asian Peninsula, so I struggle. You know more than I do. I I couldn't. 
I not even the slightest bit. But can you discern between Cherokee and Latin? I wasn't required to learn a language, but I chose German. Ah, how how good do you see you are with your German? Because I chose Spanish, because I already knew a little bit of Spanish, because I grew up in a Spanish-speaking household. But I, 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 my, my Spanish is pitiful for what I, for how I grew up. I've caught another stream. Hi, Ismond, how are you? <laughs> How's it going? Uh, and they uh, taught it long after your brain. Yes, they taught it long after your brain stopped learning languages naturally. Yes, they should have done it like elementary school, but it was a high school elective. Like, okay, learn language if you want, and we'll teach you just the bare, bare basics. This is one of those scripts. Which is it? Uh. Oh, don't worry, it's not anything offensive, just saying what day it is. I'll guess it's the Cherokee language, that script there, because it looks kind of like what I what you showed me the other day. Oh, from what I remember, Cherokee script was created during the American invasion of the 19th century. But beyond that, I don't know anything of it. Uh, like a three-year-old Neil. That's... That's something. I don't even know what I'd, what I'd rank my, my, my Spanish skills as. I'm not even sure if that good. <laughs> no one's here to help, so I'll have to handle things myself. It's not so bad here in the no judgment zone. No one's around to help, but that's just fine. Sometimes the best thing you can be is a loved one. Oh, uh. My German is so bad. I went from the fluency of a 10 year old down to a toddler. No, no, no shame in that. Because my, my, my. I don't even think I ever had the fluency of a 10 year old. Oof, yeah, I was forced to take French in school. Oh dear. Oh, I read a short, uh, short kid level story about Mr. Sequoia who put together the letters used for, and I'm hoping I'm not wrong, the Cherokee language. That sounds, uh. That sounds about right, I think. Keeping up with languages is hard if you don't use them often, so don't feel bad. Yeah. Oh, mini Miyamura. Uh, <laughs> very pretty senorita. <laughs> that was pretty good. Very pretty senorita. <laughs> this is correct. Oh, okay. It is right. That is the less common spelling of uh, Sequoia. Emotes. Between emotes and model. Two, two, two. Okay. Focus, Minnie. Focus. You're capable of focusing. You are. You've done it once before. You could do it again. And what's a good font to have the word scuff in? It's gonna have to have an outline. It's gonna have to have an outline. So it's visible. I don't think I could make emotes. <laughs> Saying pixel art isn't good for emotes. I've seen some very, very, very cute pixel art emotes. Pixel art would look ad adorable in emotes. Actually, pixel art's probably... Oh! <laughs> How to use this redeem. You just, uh, uh, get, provide me with the name of an emote or just any emote, whether that's an emote in, like, just a global emote or, um, an emote I have in my, like, the panel below. And I will place that emote upon myself. But yeah, regarding where, uh, <laughs> yeah, those little lovebirds are so cute. Ah, you want me to place that emote on myself for guide more? Because <laughs> I can. Is that your emote of choice? Uh, you can make emotes with Pixar. Check this out. Those are really nice. You did it in those little lovebirds. Cake. <laughs> Cake. 
that it's inherently difficult for Pixar emotes. I feel it's... I don't know. It's the panic working on emotes face. <laughs> it truly is. Okay, uh, let me grab that emote then for to place upon me. Uh, I guess it all depends on your perspective. What, what? Because I feel like these, this canvas I'm using is massive. Because I don't, I can't draw such a small little area. But the good thing is there's this tool called Peppy. Actually, I should link it. That lets you preview how your emotes will look in their proper sizes when they're uploaded to Switch. It's real nice. Uh, it lets you preview and also exports them. Preview emotes, badges, and icon. Here it is. There's a free version and then there's a... Uh, like a free demo and then a $15 version, which I still haven't paid for yet, but I still... One of these days I have to. Because it's, it's a nice tool and I like it a lot. I thought even like 20, 20 max pixels. You could do that. Actually, what's the largest size a Twitch e emo can be? Oh, hang on. Let me place this emote upon me. Uh, do, 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 do. My folder of emotes. Blink. What? Not me. Nope. Not me. The emote. Enlarge the emote and shrink myself. Oh, 120, uh, 120 pixels. Okay, 120 by one, uh, 128 by 128. Yeah. Ah, okay. The emotes I draw are like 28 by 28. Uh, you've got this. I love making pixel art version of scripts. So many pixel artists in here. Wonderful. Adiki, I'm just not the greatest at pixel art. Pixel art is so cute. I want to see. I don't. I don't feel that I'm the best at making emotes, but I'm. I'm just like brute forcing my way through this. <laughs> Could I show you guys my most recent ultra low res Cherokee script? Sure. Uh, how do you go about sharing it though? Like, is it is it a pn? Like, is it an image file? Oh, sorry, I'm still catching up to chat. Uh, but yeah, I understand the feeling, Esmond, of not feeling like the greatest at art. I understand that so very well. But even if your art's... Even if you feel your art's not great, which I feel the same way about my art, people are so very kind and understanding, like, the, the expression you put into it. That's good. I like that. I'll use this and treasure it forever. <laughs> it's real nice. Uh, nobody is. You don't have to be the greatest. You just have to be you, and that's enough. But also, don't force yourself. That's not healthy. Yeah, that's, yep. You're so right, gal. Uh, so when you draw a pixel art emotes, it's best to draw it in 28 by 28 and upscale it from there. <laughs> Your emote looks like a girl. <laughs> this is my second head. <laughs> it does look like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, um. So when you draw pixel art emotes, it's best to draw it in 28 by 20 and upscale it from there. Also, thank you, uh, for the compliments. You're very welcome. Your emotes are very, very cute. Uh, the larger pixels are for retina screens, and the 24 pixel ones are for really low fidelity screens. This is why Twitch emotes are so crisp on iPhone. Oh, I haven't- I have, I don't know how crisp they look. I ain't got no iPhone. I ain't never had no iPhone. That's too fancy for me. <laughs> yeah, I struggle with doing that in high res- uh, that high res of images. 20 by 20 is too huge for me. Much too big. Hmm. I guess you could work by- in your 20 by 20 and like, upscale that and then work with that. Not sure. I don't know what the be what the best way is to approach this. Because I'm working with, like, I think this is a thousand by a thousand or something. That I'm work like, each square here is a thousand by a thousand. And then I use the... Oh, I didn't actually link the, the tool in chat. There's this tool that you can use to export your, uh... 
your artwork into the proper sizes. Meetings. Oh, okay, Savita. Enjoy. Uh, have a good time at your meeting. I hope it's not eating. I hope it's approvals all around. See you later, Savannah. Thank you for the lurk. Uh. Oh, I'll share a link to the image when I'm ready. Okay, I'm just ready myself. Okay. Uh, let me permit. Get up, turn your chainsaw on. Power off, power on. Now let's start with this tree here. Hello, gear. Hi, gear. Come on, hurry, 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 hurry. Uh, yeah, with Pixar, it's more an issue that up, uh, slash down scaling makes it look real funky at times. Yeah, I, but I guess there's some adjustments you could do. I don't know. Aren't you glad now? Good luck, you can do this. Good luck, Savannah. Have fun. <laughs> Bam. Oh no, Chrome doesn't like this link. Good thing I used Firefox. Never use just tin chains for them. Oh. Cute. I see lots of letters I recognize. <laughs> Some I don't, but quite a few I do. It's ultra low res, 5 by 5 Hurry, 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 hurry. Don't you worry, worry the tree's gonna go back surely. Ain't this fun now? Aren't you glad now? Oh, the text. My teen saw's the best in the town. What's a good font for this? Use Joe's shin chains for them, no. Jamming, hot slamming, laughing. Mm -hmm. Rockin', rollin' all night long. Now that we've come so far, tell me just who you are. Are you my shining star? Let me see your guitar! Do -do. Oh, we created a pretty good guitar! <laughs> we sure did! That was fun! That was fun! <laughs> oh, uh... So for emotes, what I do is I draw it in 20 by 20 and export it as... With... I don't know how, to, how that would be, or 100, I assume that's 100% size, and then as 200% size to get uh, 56 by 56, and finally as 400% to get uh, 112 by 112. This way it's clear and readable every time, but 20 by 20 is huge. I suppose you could, I don't know, I guess it's just all a matter of experimenting with from 20 to 28 by 28 to... 56 by 56 and 112 by 112. Maybe there's some workaround. Not sure. Oh, I could uh, also try making some turkey text in this if you guys want to see that, I guess. Wait, turkey text in, uh... In where? Like, in chat? Oh, so if you look at my emotes, uh, in the 5 by font... Uh, five by five font I showed. Oh, sure. Uh, I don't know how you can, how you show it. But if you need, if you need to share a link again, let me know and I'll, I'll do that. I'll let, I'll give you the permit. Time to hand draw an image. So if you look at my emotes, uh, this little love bird on the toilet, for example, you notice that neither the bird nor the toilet are 20p in size. It's two small objects combined. You also can see the white outline, which adds another pixel in size. 
Oh. <laughs> I love the 100% frog friend. Thank you. That's 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 some progress. That's progress. Inspired by Oh, I have it somewhere, don't I? Uh, originally This is a very cute little uh GIF animation pixie made. Uh I know it's in the Discord somewhere. Do -do -do. Progress, that's incredible. <laughs> Thank you. It was all it was a spur of the moment thing, the progress. A very cute progress. And there will also be a, a frog to go with it. Frogstration. For when those days when you just can't make any progress. Pixie also came up with the frogstration pun. <laughs> Hang on. Okay, here is the image. Oh my goodness, frogstration sounds so good too. <laughs> may the frog Oh, may the frogstration has the throat all puffed out. Oh, you're right. Like just <sighs> like very all huffy and frustrated, frogstrated. <laughs> That's real cute. Hey Angie. Oh, uh, boink! There's the progress. Animated and just delightful. Oh, and uh, two, 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 two. Pixie. And this is Pixie, who created this little frog and gave me permission to base an emote off of it because it's just so darn cute. But yeah, I, I, my chat seems to have a lot of very talented pixel artists, it seems. I've always wanted to, well, I suppose I did once try some pixel art. It's probably, there's probably some file on my computer somewhere with some pixel art on it. But nothing, nothing too grand, just like a little s pixel sketch, basically. Okay, frog with with cheeks or er, like puffed out throat. Hang on, w I I have a frogstration doodle somewhere here. Oh, there it is. If I get rid of, okay, remove first try. Do 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 do. Group all those layers together. Uh, do do do. Uh oh, freeze, frozen, frozen. Oh. Okay, there we go. This is frogstration. <laughs> but I could do a version where the throat's all puffed out. Or maybe like it's if it's animated, it could be like that's like the like the first frame where it's just like huh, and then puffs up the uh the throat with frustration. But let me make a, a doodle of that frame. Uh eraser. We just can't progress today. I suppose to have a throat. How do I get this chibi frog to make it look like he has a puffed throat? Uh I did not take that into consideration. <laughs> I did not take that into consideration. Uh? Wide upper stomach. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, like just. Bleh. Neck. Neck fluff. Oh, 
Pardon my yawning. Actually, let me let me look up an image of the Forbidden Frogger. Great quest. I always want to call it great great adventure. I guess I could just open up a video of Frogger to see. What was like the term we came up with it? It was like some... It's something that rhymed. I can't remember. <laughs> throat float. Throat float. That's right. Throat float. Uh Okay. Oh, 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 Biddy! Hi! How you doing, Biddy? Recovering well from your from your twelve hour stream the other day, I hope. Minnie, hi Biddy, how are you? <laughs> I'm here! It's good to have you here! How are you recovering from your 12-hour stream? Oh, I just got off work! How are you recovering from work? <laughs> oh dear! Busy, busy, biddy. Life is hard. Unrelenting. So cruel. But I hope things will go better soon. Frog hug. Frog. Frog versus frog sad. Frog hug. My 12 hour stream made my computer angry. I can only imagine. Like the heat that my computer accumulates after just like a 5 hour stream is pain. I can only imagine the. The fire it would have set for a 12 hour stream. Oh my goodness. But I hope you had a fun time. Ah, pardon my yawning, my goodness. It was very fun. It, it was it was a lot of fun to hang out there. I always put an electric fan next to the computer for that. That's that's a good idea. I need an electric fan. I don't know if it helps, but I hope it does. I, I think that could do some good. Not any bad, I think. You need to play that game, Minnie. Oh, you mean the Kirby, uh, Kirby's Dream Buffet? The Kirby one? Yeah, I need to someday. There's so many, there's just so many games I need to play. But that one in particular is just so cute. Da, 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 da. Oh, sorry, I'm looking for an image of Frogger puffing out his throat, his throat float powers from my own stream because <laughs> I can't find an image on Google Images that that is that suffices. Gizzard. <laughs> it's like his whole face. I guess it would have to be kind of like... Not just... Wait. Uh-oh. Pen pressure? Wait, what? Something... Okay, never mind. Psyching myself out. Mm 
So I said I was gonna leave at 7.45, but uh... 8. <laughs> 8 instead. Because I feel I have not done enough work to justify me leaving in 5 minutes. It's just your... It's business as usual here on Cinnamon East Stream. Twenty-four hour stream time. No, 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 no. I don't even know what I would do for twenty-four hours. I can only imagine the delirium that would ha that would that would occur, because I can get delirious after just one hour. Twenty-four hours. Oh no. <laughs> But yeah, don't force yourself to make Pixar emotes. You're valid the way you are. Don't doubt yourself. Yeah, like, I, I would say give it a go. Give it a go at, at trying some Pixar emotes. In... I, even, even if they're not perfect, people just like emotes. People just like expressing their feelings with their... With... In silly little ways. <laughs> 24 hours. Watch this, watch me as I watch some cartoons after hour seven. <laughs> just just give it a give it your best shot. Fire away. Uh in Give the people what they want, which is emotes. They want emotes. They they crave emotes. Just like I crave violence, the people crave emotes. So I will satiate their desire for emotes, but who will satiate my desire for violence? Oh! Squishy beans! That is a cute emote! <laughs> right, Jupa? Look at the way that squish. Any leg breakers in the house? Any leg breakers in the house tonight? <laughs> I temporarily have beans again. You need a you need to get you need to like commission a bean emote for yourself so you can never so you can never be caught beanless again. <laughs> I always wanted to learn how to play the violin so I could understand your hunger for violins. Yep. Violin is a beautiful instrument. Anyone play any instruments in here? And if not, if you do play an instrument, what, instru what instrument do you play? If you don't play an instrument, what instrument would you like to learn? Well, Miles, you play some instruments. I know that. I've seen you in concert. In virtual concert. I haven't seen you live. As far as you know. <laughs> I have not seen you in person. I was undercover. You couldn't see you couldn't tell it was me in my fursuit. But I was there and I was watching. I used to play the drums. I was a I was a percussionist in our school orchestra, but I could never keep a V. Oh <laughs> In person <laughs> Cause I don't I don't see things in person. That that's I I I'm not person. I'm person. You were the first suit pile on the floor. <laughs> that I was. You could have never guessed. I was hidden in plain sight. Took piano lessons. Oh, how far did that go? Do you think you, you do you think you still retain that? Always watching the furry version of Alex Mech. I am not familiar with this reference. Google, help me.
The Secret Life of Alex Mack. Or Secret World of Alex Mack? <laughs> Help me, Ghoul, you're my only hope! <laughs> I took piano lessons. How far did that go? From here to Michigan. <laughs> oh, but it's the Mario song. Yep, this is yeah, uh, this is a Mario Party uh this song uh is Mario uh from Mario Party 9. It's got a little bit of that do do do. It's real cute. I like the way they mixed it in. Yes, the goo girl. I do not know this goo girl. Ain't never heard of her. Do 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 Hardly I struggled to practice then. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> oh, Link. Okay. Permit. Bread bun bun. Link. There you are, bread bun bun. Uh, okay, catching up the chat. Uh, okay, it took forever because I had to clean up this upscale, but whatever, I managed to do it. Has a link. Oh, you already got it, okay. Would well, like to learn how to play the accordion, but it ain't easy. Oh, I think my aunt used to have an accordion, but it... Huh. <laughs> accordion is not easy to learn. Accordion to who? <laughs> Going to eight. Yep, to eight. To eight. Eight is when I go and uh, leave, get some dinner. Also, what instrument do I want to learn? Only one. Uh Oh, I just probably want to learn my favorite instrument, the theremin. Oh, nice choice. Or more properly, the etherphone. I don't know how that's pronounced, but the theremin. We had a discussion of this long ago, of very intriguing instruments. I sent a puff, uh, draft of puff throat in the, in the story. Oh, uh, I'll check that in just a moment. Oh. Oh, and I could compare it to like the title of the of the album. Interesting. Do 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 do. Runway. The text written is the title. Oh, yep, yep. <laughs> and Bob's walk that runway. Oh, no. Oh, no. Typo. Oh. I don't quite see where it is, but oh dear. <laughs> I wouldn't have noticed if you hadn't said. Even now, I still don't notice. Oh, uh, still catching up to chat. Sorry. <laughs> Going to eat. Uh, is it the, is the first try star finished? Oh no, not not no, uh, not finished. I just uh, moved it out of the way so I can get to the frog stration frog because all these layers are disastrous. <laughs> Good see many with a ukulele or ukulele. I, I I believe that's the proper pronunciation. Ukulele or tambourine, castanets. <laughs> What instrument did I want to learn? I suppose I didn't really... I was more of interested in the... Uh, vocals. Even back in the radioactive dinosaurs days when I, I couldn't play an instrument but I was like, I, I can be the vocals. I could, I could front a band. I could be the lead vocal in a band called Radioactive Dinosaurs. That'll work out. <laughs> I 
I truly have no idea what we're thinking of with, with the radioactive dinosaurs. Volkus is a valid instrument. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I suppose I never really... I, we, we, used to, we might actually still have it somewhere. An electric, uh, keyboard. So hard for me to tune. Same. Same. <laughs> I used to have this, um... And I might still have somewhere in storage a, um... Electric piano. A keyboard. Um... At one point, I could do, like, the melody to Tetris. I, 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 I taught myself the... But I I couldn't even get like the first these days. No, that was that was years ago. That was so many years ago. I fixed the typo. Oh, is it is it, is it the same link or a new link? New link. Okay. Can do. Do 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 do. Permit. Red. Fun. Fun. I used to play the harmonica for fun. My grandpa had this super tiny one. Used to play that all day, every day. <laughs> fun. I had a Yamaha, Yamaha keyboard back in the day. It might have also been a Yamaha that I had. I can't remember completely. I had and may possibly still have Yamaha keyboard. Yeah, a motorbike. <laughs> no, I have no license. I have no vehicle. This looks pretty similar to what I had back in the day. <laughs> But without this, uh, sheet music holding thing. Oh no, this looks too fancy. The, 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 the screen did not look like that. Or maybe that's just what the, what it, what it looks like in this image, but... It looks pretty similar to this, but older. And without that sheet music holding thing. Oh, uh, okay, the link. That bread bun bun has shared. Eight minutes left, chat. Oh, uh, <laughs> the distractions keep happening. I uh, would tune it to uh, to flute to try to catch the tune since it was the closest to my voice. So it just keep uh, humming until I found the piano key that matched. Then string it together at, for an original song as a ten year old. Oh, cute. One model of many. Yeah, there's probably a bunch, but this one looks close-ish. <laughs> but what if I want my even to the right? You're on to, to the right. You're on fire with these with these puns. You're you're very punny today, gal. Prepare your raid redeem targets now. Oh yes, if you have someone in mind you'd like to raid after the stream's over, that there is a redeem for that. Oh, I screwed up because I wrote uh. That kind of R instead of uh, just a straight R, I would not have ever noticed. Oh, hi Falcon, how are you? Ains is ready to deem it regard more. <laughs> I'm Friday only, Falcon, you know this. You know the drill. Looks at a mirror. Oh, okay, uh, Yamaha, be gone. Uh, let me find a good font for this big old scuff on my head. Howdy, how's it going? Howdy, partner. H how would a cowboy say, like, how are you doing? Like, okay, howdy's hello, but how you're doing? Mm. I don't know, I can't recall off the top of my head. You play any instrument, Falcon? Oh yes! Would you like to share with us your your instrumental? That's a topic for one minute. 
I don't play instruments. That is a, that is a falsehood. That is a falsehood. Oh, how do you actually shortening of how do you do? Oh, how how do you do? Oh, yeah. So it's all it's all encompassing. Howdy, howdy, Barney. But Barney. <laughs> Howdy, partner. How do you do, partner? Da, 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 da. Howdy, partner. <laughs> Howdy. Miles. Every time my 12 year old self would be ashamed of my current self for finding this funny. <laughs> my teenage self would be so ashamed of my sense of humor. <laughs> How do you do what? Turn on the TV, press the red button on the remote. <laughs> well, it all depends. Nobody turns on the TV anymore. It's all about the PC. But we have a, we have a, a way to revive the, the TV. We combine it with the PC. Make the hang on. I, I gotta I gotta think this out in my head, or no on on visually. Okay, hang on. There's CV plus PC equals the PTCV, the personal telecomputer vision. Personal telecomputer vision. Yep, that's the future. Four minutes when do you do high regard more as a clock? <laughs> she is my manager and my my caretaker. <laughs> you cannot play straight with the game. Cause I know that you're gonna behave like a child from the world way up above. Cause I know that you're gonna behave like a child from the world way up above. In any case, it's all up to you. If you could just show me just what you could do. Oh, red bun bun. So you you've got this font you've made for uh for Cherokee. I suppose. Well, I don't know if you've made it yourself or if there does exist somewhere out there a Klingon font. Rescue me quick, or I'm gonna be the angel's next pick. You don't want to see me get hurt. The angel's been mean to me, that's for sure. Yes. Okay, such a thing does exist. If I could have have another wish, I want the devil to join my next dish. And if I can't have another one, I'll turn my back and go on the run. <laughs> PTCV rolls off the tongue. PTCV, it is the future. This is many eight, 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 ain't eight in 30 minutes. <laughs> many of the rate timer is two minutes. Uh, three minutes, but uh, actually, anyone could, uh, yeah, it's, it's three minutes. Uh, yes, there's a Klingon outfit, and I did make my own Pixar versions. Oh, nice! Have two potential raid teams trying to decide unless someone else wants to take it. Anyone, whoever, whoever wants to go. I don't want to take it. Let me get uh, one of the Pixar versions I made. Okay. Feel free, anyone. No, no worries. Uh, if not today, if we don't reach a raid target today, we can always do it another day. I stream quite often. I'm going to double to turn my next dish. But if I can't have another one, I'll turn my back and go on the run. Time comes for me, for me to have fun. Time comes for me, for me to have fun. But I don't like fun in the sun. Talking about no getting tired. Staying close in the fire. Not stop but never ending. Always the strong defending. Got it ready. Oh, okay. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep. Congratulations. Gee, thanks. 
Gee, thanks. I'll never give up. He's so cute. Jump in, throw it up. Gee, thanks. I'll never give up. Is the scuff going to be visualized as some sort of object or just a font? I was thinking just a font, but like, I don't know. What's it? What what object signifies scuff? And like, is like gonna bonk me on the head? That's a, that's a good question. I I could replace it with something, maybe, or maybe like an alternate version, like one that's just the word scuff. And then, huh? I was thinking like a brick or rock bonking your head. <laughs> a brick with the word like the word scuff painted onto it. Yeah, with scuff written on it. <laughs> Glitch the font. A labeled mallet. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, it needs to be more apparent that it's scuffy. Stream scuff. Interesting. This font. Good font could work. Yeah, to make it more apparent. These are very neat fonts you have. We're over time. Oh, yes. Very, very interesting. Uh... Thank you for all you've taught us about Klingon and Cherokee Bread Bun Bun and showing us your fonts. They're really cool. Okay, we're over time. See y'all next time. See y'all next time. I goodness, not a lot was accomplished today. Well, on on in the in the, in terms of art. <laughs> Have a great day, y'all. Back back at you, gal. Okay, uh, let me get to my just chatting screen, and if someone wants to redeem a rare target. Please feel free uh, to, 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 to do so. Uh, just chatting. Blink. Aha. Oh, there you go. Uh, progress police will have to hear about this lack of progress. The progress police. No. <laughs> Gift shop is to the left. Grab a snack on your way out. <laughs> Uh, Nipo Yote. Uh, again, since I'm not sure how often I'll stream at this hour. Sure, that's fine. And I believe, uh... Yeah, okay. Make can do. The real progress is being able to de-stress to de during stream. Well, that's that's an accomplishment for me, I suppose. I'm glad I could do such a thing. Re-guide more. <laughs> that's always nice to do. Even if I didn't make very much progress with my art, which I should have done! That's an accomplishment. Is being able to help people de-stress is real nice. Get novelty pictures where you're photoshopped together with Minnie. <laughs> Someone in a big, like, mini mascot costume you could take pictures with. Stick your face in the- Oh yeah, the, the, the face hole cut out pictures. Set the flaps, turn the lights, fasten your seatbelts, put a plate. Set the flaps, turn the lights, fasten your seatbelts, put a plate. Get one more and run on the track, show me what you got, soldier. Get one more and run on the track, show me what you got, soldier. Did I eat my drink? Did you eat your drink? I thought milk was pink. <laughs> I thought milk was pink. Little bit of this, little bit of that. A little bit of that, a little bit of that. <laughs> I think there's a there's a sin of fluster in your ear. Yep. She is we're she just grew on me. <laughs> I'll miss my train. You'll miss your train. I'll miss my brain. May I help you? Set the flaps, turn the lights, fast your seatbelts. Put a flight, set the flaps, turn the lights, fast your seatbelts. Put a flight. Get them more than in the chat. Show me what you got, soldier. Get them more than in the chat. Show me what you got, soldier. Bring all the food in, the drinks all for me. They're bonding. We're bonded. We're the best of the closest of friends. You think I'm old. You think I'm cold. You make me bold. I'm right. You never had the gold. I think you're old. I think you're cold. You make me bold. I'm right. You never had the gold. But I don't care, even if I don't have hair. The only thing that matters in life is to take care. Sorry, it keeps happening. <laughs> so much for Appa. So very much. But, um, 
Thank you all very, very much for everything today, for chatting, for hanging out. She's a marsupial. <laughs> Are you ready to raid Nifo Yoni? Uh, in just a second, I, just, I gotta say my thank yous like I usually do, because I'm very, very thankful to all of you. Thank you, too. Thank you! Thank you all very much for being here. Chatting, lurking, teaching us languages. It's all... It's all a wonderful time. Sorry I didn't do very much art, but... Hopefully it was the stream was fun despite the lack of art. <laughs> Thank you for streaming. Thank you very, very much. Do you think that I'm old enough to fly? I don't know, son. I just want to try. I'm still wondering when I die. I hope I get to eat. I hope I don't cry. You're still wondering when you die. You hope you get to eat. You hope you don't cry. <laughs> and hello and help. Thank you for the hellos and the help. Thank you for the stream. Hashtag gay furry fashion. We can make that a thing. It can be a thing. If it's not already a thing, actually. Hang on. <laughs> Hello. Help. Help. More forever. Oh, it's a thing, alright. Oh, it's a thing. Oh, cute. Okay, one second to show this image of these fursuits in a rainbow. Like, they, they're they holding these Crayolas. They're so cute. Somebody say ho. Say ho. Ho. Hi, Yuki. Sorry, I was just about to read. Huh? How are you doing? Somebody say ho. Say ho. Ho. Say ho. 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 No scream. What you gonna do? When they come, good. That's good to hear. When they come, that's even better to hear. Good, without the typos. <laughs> gotta receive. I can spell. I can sometimes. I gotta believe. It. Oh, everybody, just check out the way I live. Everybody, yo, yo, everybody. It's the time you've been waiting for everybody Uh oh, uh oh, here comes a dude And now he's running up and down the street with the juice Sunny's in my life, she's like a dice I can't tell which way she'll turn to ice spice Whatever trouble he's in, he just gets us to begin Ain't no problem for the man And I would do it like that, because I want it like that No other difference is the fact You gotta do what? I gotta receive I gotta believe I gotta redeem I gotta believe! Look how cute this is! I gotta believe! I gotta redeem! I gotta receive! You gotta do what? I gotta believe! H to the E to the R to the O Now here comes your hero, oh here he goes P to the A to the R to the A For rapper's the name I rap every day Now it's time for the rough fat night And let's all pump up the night Freaking out was the name of the game for me You, 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 and you What's his name? He grew up in this town Check this out, come on and break it down Kick, punch, chop, I got the funky flow and my X the flower into the bowl. Okay, I gotta stop. I gotta I gotta stop is what I gotta do. <laughs> I gotta receive. I gotta believe. Okay, let me start the read. Thank you all so very, very much. She rapping. <laughs> what you gonna do when they come? I gotta receive. Can't stop. <laughs> Can't stop. Won't stop. <laughs> let me send you to Nipple Yori. Got that right. You gotta do what? I gotta believe What you gonna do When they come I gotta receive Ho ho <laughs> I gotta believe Wrap to the end Thank you all so much I hope you enjoy your stay Send sweet dreams to Nipple Yori And remember You gotta believe Somebody say ho Say ho ho Say ho 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 No scream Somebody say ho Say ho ho Say ho 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 Now scream <laughs> Thank you all so very much Sorry for keeping you so long Parappa, he's got a hold on me, you know Okay, a minute remains of the of Until we read 
somebody say ho, 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 ho. now scream. <laughs> But yeah, thank you all so very much. I'll be back tomorrow with hopefully more art, hopefully less distractions. Uh, but yeah, back tomorrow. Number top top back again, yes forever. You have many challenges coming at you fast as a fire. Don't retire now. Pick so much parappa, so much parappa all in a row. I need a dinner to recover from the parappa. Twenty seconds remain. Oh my goodness! Thank you all so much. More beans. Have a fun time. We're gonna have a fun time over at Nippo Yote, who is a very talented singer. So I hope you enjoy your time. Oh, five seconds. Bye. Thank you so much, everyone. Bye. Mm -hmm. Da -da -da.